I mean, again, he, he doesn't know who Gabriel is, right? Because he didn't come from an Abrahamic faith. The people of Mecca were pagan. The Quran has mentioned if this book was from other than God, they would have found in it many contradictions. If a book is without contradictions, that has no bearing on whether it comes from God or not. I've had phone books that are inerrant, but I certainly don't think God gave them. <laughs> that we believe without understanding. Take this Uyghur flag, you saw them! That the standard narrative has holes. The prophet That's tells us because Satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils. Those who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan urinates in their ears. I really do think Jesus was crucified and that he really was dead and buried. He, he thought that he was a son of God in the sense that he was specially chosen by God. I think Jesus really did think he was going to be the Messiah, the future king of Israel. I mean, that is, after all, why they crucified him. Hello everyone and peace of Christ all of you. Please invite your friends and let us have some good time together. Please take to your notes that anyone will speak out of our topic in the chat. I will block him. I don't have more patience to idiots. So if you are one of them, please leave. Our topic today is, is Islam kind of mental illness? No, I'm not really asking. I'm going to confirm that. I have my Skype open. If you are a Muslim and you want to prove me wrong, please feel free. You know, when uh, when somebody he says he have a religion, then we ask, okay, what is uh, what is your religion? What is the purpose of this religion? What you what exactly your religion stand for? Uh, maybe this is a good question to ask the Muslims about. I mean, okay, you have a religion. It's called Islam. What does religion stand for? If there's any Muslim would like to call us and tell us what Islam stands for. If you are a Muslim and you know what your religion stands for, please feel free. We have somebody um, here, let us see, he's a Muslim. <coughs> Hello. Yes, my friend, you are live on air. I see you try to oh, call me many times. <laughs> yes, I, I do it. Okay, yeah. So we were, our topic today is Islam is a kind of mental illness. What do you think? Mental illness is mm. nothing to do with mental illness. The mental illness are the Christians. Mm, why? Okay, tell me why you think Islam is not a mental Be illness religion. Because we are peaceful people. It's the Christians who are, who are always angry. You know, you see uh, David Wood. Mm. Some Shimon, they uh -huh. agree, they uh, they agree they have mental illnesses, but they still they mm. come out and swear, shout, and say disgusting words. Mm. They, they, they talk so about David Wood and the Sam Shimon, they agree that they have mental illness. They do. Watch their bloody yeah. interviews, yeah. the videos. Well, I they don't know. Say, I mean, the, uh, David Wood, he... he, he uh, he have a degree, and as a he became a, a PhD, he have a PhD. So, Who else? so your prophet, your prophet did not PhDs. know. They don't have PhDs. Come on, okay. Sam. Okay, okay. Sam Hemon has got no. Okay, you see, who care about anyway? Who care about uh, yeah. uh, 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 names you mentioned? <laughs> who care about even me and you? You know, we are talking about religion, about God. Is your prophet crazy? No, no prophet. Our God's not crazy. Okay, I'm, so why the Quran is saying? Why the Quran he said that Muhammad? Allah, he found oh. him lost and he guided thee, you know, so he was a crazy or not? Because not only crazy not, people, not. they are lost. Not lost, not lost. Not, okay, not, read not, for not, me, not. chapter 93, verse number 7. You've, you've caught me, you've caught me outside where? Well, you are the one who mentioned it, let us see. You're a prophet himself, the one who want to guide us, he himself is lost, is mental. Uh, what's the... Chapter ninety, chapter ninety-three, verse number seven. Ninety-three, seven. <coughs> oh, yeah. uh, I don't hear you. Your voice is not uh, clear. 
Your Lord did not abandon you. Quran. I don't uh, hear you. You know, did you? Did are you? Are you using a storing phone? Yeah, your Lord did not abandon you. I don't hear you. Your mic is not working, my friend. Stop moving. So, 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 Quran verse ninety-three. Hmm. Verse three. Verse seven. Oh, seven. Sorry. It says here, it says, and, and I found you wandering. Hmm. Wandering does not mean lost. This is your translation. The, the Arabic it says dull, and dull and mean lost. Not only, not it's only lost. I mean, he's, a, he's a, you know, not only lost, you know, he is, uh, he's like, you know, oh. in Arabic we oh. say, kalban dalan, you know, like a, a, a dog who have a rab rabies. Come on, no, no. Honestly, no, no, you can no, no. go ask right now. I can tie for it you the sentence. Kalban al kilabu dalan, al kilabu dalan, dogs who have rabies. So your prophet, he was no, lost and he have rabies. No, come on. That is what you are, that's, that's your own <clears throat> Christian. Well, the word there is, uh, is, is dalan, what, is, what does that mean, wondering? What wondering? Even the translation in front of me, which is made by a Muslim saying lost. I've got uh, I've got translation is saying wandering, mm. the meaning you know when he was you know on his own all the all the Arabs were worshiping idols and mm. then God seen him. Well, we God have Muhammad. we have Sheikh we have Sheikh Uthman. He said Muhammad he was an a pagan person. He do not know who is all who, who's, who's God. No, no, no. Who do no, not? No, yeah, not here, here we go. I will I will play the video for you. What are you talking about? We forget, have it. Forget Uthman. He's not he's not my bloody uh, scholar. He's not my scholar. So is, is he? Scholar. So why he's why he's why is he lying about Muhammad? He the said. The truth is. He you... said. He said. I want you to confront me. He said that Muhammad he do not know what Abrahamic faith. He is not Abrahamic faith. He said that, and he said, and this is why he do not know who is Jibril. And he said right away because the Arab we were pagan, so he is saying clearly that he, don't, he is not Abrahamic faith, and he do not know Gabriel, and uh, he, his uh, his people are pagan. That's why he don't know. So he's pagan. So what do you say? <clears throat> and the order uh, left him standing. <laughs> no, the truth is the truth is yeah you. You know, you did I, not answer, answer me. What do you think about what Sheikh Uthman? This is a big Sheikh, you know. According to Muslims, he is number one Sheikh in the world. Who is Uthman Farouk? Yeah, he is not that. He is not the biggest Sheikh in the world. Come so what on, he man. is? So what he is? So what he is? Good. He's good at teaching. He's good at you know. Teaching. Here we go. He is good at teaching. So is that a good teaching or not? You what? what you see, you're contradicting yourself. What? He is good what? in teaching. He said, he said that Muhammad his... do not. He is not Abrahamic. He said he is not Abrahamic. He is good in teaching. You just say that, so you confirm that he has a, have a certification. So, do you agree with him or not? He is Abrahamic. Prophet Muhammad was in the line of Ish Ishmael. Hold on. So, courage. why he said? Why your Sheikh said he is not Abrahamic? Well, there is no hadith saying that he wasn't Abrahamic. The Quran in front of you, he's saying he wasn't Abrahamic because if he is, if, if he is lost, uh, if he was Abrahamic, he is not lost. No, but you know, you know the context <clears throat> of the of the word, you know, of this verse is, you know, whenever he used to be on his own, he used to go to the cave, and he used, you know, rest there. To what is he's that? Got... You know, Muhammad, he maybe he go to the cave just to clean his mum when he go poo poo because he no, like privacy. No, 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 no. Because the people at that time were worshiping idols, and he did not worship idols. He well, Muhammad he worship him. idols. No, no, no. Where you show me the hadith where the Muhammad worship idols? In no hadith. First, first of all, first of all, is is idols forbidden in Islam? Of course it is. Yes. Who said that to you? Eh? Who Allah said that? Allah says that. Where? Allah says that you can't worship anything else. You you you, you cannot worship anything else except. Allah. So all these okay, idols. What if Allah is an idol Himself? You see, you oh, just said on. you should answer you're yourself. You said, rubbish. huh? So is Allah you're talking is a... rubbish here? No, he's not idol. Okay. He's a, he's a so unseen. so why why Suleiman he was making idols in his temple according to the Quran? Where we wish in which verse he saying making idols? Chapter thirty-four, verse number thirteen. 
<coughs> they were making an address to Allah, right? Stop moving your microphone. I don't hear you no more. I don't hear you. It just says that it just says that he built he built water basins. No, they made the statues. Here we go in Arabic. It says, "What a mathil, what a mathil." Here we go in front of you. You Muslims are a bunch of liars when you translate. You take the word mathil off. Some translation they took it off because they are a bunch of fraud. This is actually actually a clear sign of mental illness that somebody he claimed that he have a holy book and he will not change the book and then when he translate the book he take the whole words off. No, no, no. It's in the front of you. It says Tamathil. And stop moving your microphone. I can't hear you no more. No, no, no. I'm here. I'm here. Okay, I'm hold on. You know I cannot hear you, my friend. Go and get a new microphone. I'm not going to waste my time. If you want to talk to me, you have to fix your microphone. I know, no, but the thing is, you 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 call me the wrong time because I was I was just I was out the moment. That's that's why. No, your microphone is moving. It's not working. No, 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 no. You're it's, being, it's, it's you're being out. Just... You're not being out. That what have to do with the microphone voice? Right. Now? Let's let's go down basics here. But, okay. So now, but, uh, does you, it say you, does it say no, statues? No. Does it say statues or not? Yeah, it does. Okay. So you Muslims, you have a statues, and the statues for who? You see, there it says a statue is not one. How many gods you worship? We only worship one god. So Space, what those statues? So what those statues are? I need to I need to go through the context of this first because you know well, this, even you know, this one need context. They, it says statues. So you have a statues. This is Allah is ordering him to order his genie to build for him a statues. Blood. So you are a Muslim all your life. You do not know that you Muslims you have a statues in your religion. No, no, we don't have statues. Trust me, we don't have statues. It's you, in the front. It's go, in the front you, of you. It's in the front of you. I don't know about this, but this is the first time I've seen this verse. This is the first time I've seen this verse. The first time I've seen this you, verse. Just... Uh, my friend, who cares if you, this is the first time or the last time? Is that my Obviously, business? You, you need, you I'm need, asking uh, you. Need... I'm asking you. Is it? Does, does it say that or not? The first time. I mean, is that a? Are you going to you cry now? It. All of you no, Muslims, when you call now. me, you say to me, "This is the first time I hear this. This is the first time I see this." What? So what I would do with you? Is that my fault? So, does it say that you would have you Muslims? You have a statues and many of them. So, how many gods you worship? Those are statues for who? Worship one. Just worship so, what one those statues God. present? Is it is it Quran verse thirty four verse what seventeen? Th thirteen. Thirty four th thirteen. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think there are thirteen statues? Wait then. Why you don't call uh, Sheikh Uthman? He can help you. Give him a call right now. Let's see if this coward he dared to speak to me. Or you know, you can call Mimi Hijab with his tits. Right time you told me he's a warrior. I don't know what kind of warrior he show his tits. He can call me. He can open the camera, show his tits to us. I want to see how what kind of a warrior he is. Call your friends that let, let them help you. 
no, it just says it just says that they built the built images. That's all. My friend, it says the statues. Don't play games with me. Yeah, you, that's you can't copy. Same thing. You can copy. Same no, thing. it's okay. That you want. It is that's a one. statue. Images. So, so you same. have no, not images is different from statues. Images is images. Statue of 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 a, of a what? It, you it, tell me. It, uh, I'm not the Muslim. It's you I, who's the Muslim. Why you don't call the tits guy? We don't know which statue he listen. He, he built. Dial this he number. Built. Dial this number. X no, X X one hundred number tits. Call, CP, yeah, call me answer, the job you, right you now. Me call him, call you, the tits boy. Answer me this question. No, you answer me this question now. You answer me mm. this question. Yeah. Mm. You have no I, idea of what these statues are. I have I an idea. So how I, can I, 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 I have an no, idea. idea. I have an no, idea. No, who have told, idea. Who told no, you? Who told you? Don't have an idea. I believe one go of on, them is on. one of them is for a penis. The other one is for vagina. The third one is for Allah. You are lying. You're lying. Prove me wrong. Okay, then. Okay, let's let's say I'm lying. Then prove me wrong. I asked you what are they. You said you do not know. Okay. Don't tell me. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. You so, don't know. I don't so know. So you how, Muslims, so you how, believe in God. You do not know anything about Him and what He is doing. So now we have a statues. Says, we do not know what the statue is for. It just says that some people, uh, Solomon, asked hmm. these jinns or whoever it was, I don't know who it was there, to build the statues, whatever. But it does not say exactly what the statues are. And, I'm and telling you, maybe it's a statues for a penis because your religion is, you a, is, a, is a penis religion. You don't know so. So CP, yeah, how can you put a question when you okay, let me you, ask you, let me ask you. you the is the black answer, stone is the black stone you have in the Kaaba already? Is it a statue or not? No, it's not. It has no. it has a shape. It has a shape of a vagina. It's a, no, no, it's a stone. It's a stone. stone does it have a, does it have a, ch a shape of a vagina? No, no, no. That's, that have you ever seen Have you ever childish. seen a vagina before? I've been I've been to the Hajj. I've seen it. I touched the. Stone. Okay, you put I your head the inside the vagina. Okay, how would you feel when you kiss the black stone? It's a stone. It's a stone. So why you it's kiss it? Okay, that, as long as you see, you're trying to prove to me that Muslim we don't have a statues. You go there, you touch it, and you kiss it. Why? Because the Prophet kissed it. Why the Prophet, the prophet kissed, kissed it? it? Why the Prophet kissed it? Respect because it was from heaven. It's from paradise. It's so from, Allah he like, sent a donkey to Muhammad from heaven. His name is Al Buraq. Are you Muslim going to go and kiss his ass? He's a donkey. Where is it? Not yet, but so the if, if, if the donkey is there now, holy. if the donkey in Mecca, you will, you must you will kiss his no, ass. No, no, but the but the but the, the donkey is not holy. The stone is from paradise. The, so you the just say the stone, the, the stone is holy. The stone is a holy stone. It, it, okay, it, 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 so you Muslims, heaven, okay, paradise. here we go. The sign of mental illness. You you lie to us saying that you worship one God who is in heaven. At the same time, yeah. you have a stone which is holy. <laughs> Why it's holy? What does holy mean? What, what does holy mean? You tell me what's holy mean. I'm learning from you. Anybody can be holy. I can be holy. Oh, you are holy. I can be holy. Uh -huh. Anybody can be holy. You are holy. Abraham is holy. What are you talking about? You are holy. I thought only God is holy. Ab no, 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 no. What, look, what look the, at oxygen. What the actually. word? What the word holy mean? All right. Wait there. What the word holy? Answer. What the word wait, holy wait, mean? Wait, 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 wait. What the word holy mean? I think you are a holy, not a holy. What the word holy mean? It's like a person, person who has who has got devotion and is close to God. Is close to God. So it's the stone. Okay, okay. So that the, here we go. You just said that your Muslim believe that the stone is a person close to God. <laughs> it's not a person. It's not a person. I said it, it does not mean it's a person. I'm, I'm saying. Uh, one 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 of the meanings is a person that is whole, close to God. Okay, give but me the meaning of holy. Stone. Stop playing games. So, what is the oh, the stone is holy? We are talking about the stone. So, is the stone of Allah, a stone you Muslim you kiss? Is it close to Allah? Is blessed. Is a blessed thing from paradise. That's why we kiss it. That's okay. why we kiss it. Is a so, blessed thing. Paradise. Okay, and when you kiss it, what what when you kiss it, what will happen? Nothing happens. Nothing. You just have respect. For example, yes, CP. For example, if you hmm. kiss your child or you or you kiss your wife does that mean you are uh worshiping your wife or you worship your kids no you no when your, i kiss my wife obviously i am in love or horny yes, so are you no, horny no. when you uh, are you are you <laughs> no are you, no is is the, when, uh, is, the black, is that why when, uh, the black uh, you, stone in the shape of a vagina when uh, you when uh, you kiss your mm. children yeah mm. why 
because because you have love for it, respect mm. for your child, you love your child, oh. same thing in this holy dawn, same thing. True CP. story. Okay, same read for thing. me. Read, okay, CP, CP. okay, read the hate in the front of me. It says here, <laughs> if you touch the black stone and the Yemeni corner, it erases your sin. So you lie to us. You said it's respect. In fact, it erases your sin. No, no, no. It is not. It does not raise your sin. It... Read it. What happened? Is your head read stuck it, inside it. the black stone? Read it. Uh, touching these two corners. Hmm. Speak louder. Speak louder. It says touching the two corners. It it is it does not say touching the. Horn, you said touching two corners. Yeah, the two corners is the black stone and the Yemeni corner. So even now, now it's more complicated. Now we have two corners, it's holy. And if you touch them, it erases your sin. And you have to go around them too, seven times, like an ant. Yeah, mm. it's not like an ant, it's not like an ant. Okay, so now you, you did lie to us saying that we kiss it out of respect. Yeah, I do. Okay, but it's a different story. It erase your. But sense. this is talking about no, no. This is talking about two corners, but we don't know what really two. Two corners. corners are. Are, are you a Muslim? Are you are you sure you are a Muslim? A Ruknul Yemeni, and those are stones brought from the temple of the Moon God from Yemen, and the black stone. So whoever touched them, his sin is erased. It could be them. It could be then. No, it could be. So, I don't lie. so you Muslims are, you know, you are suffering from mental it illness. You claim, no, no. you claim that you, you worship know, your God, and your God is the yeah. only one who erases your sin. And now we discover that but you I, Muslims are a bunch of pagan who no, touch no. stones and put your head inside of a vagina, and you think by doing that your son is oh, a is no, erased. No. Okay, okay, well, hold on. Is it true that this, the black stone used to be white? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, what yes, happened? That's true. Okay. The it says the hadith. Uh -huh. Hadith says that the children of Adam went wrong way the sin 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 and that's why it went black hmm. explain so to us way explain to us I, I'm, I'm not sure what does that mean it says that the children of Adam uh -huh. they, they were they were committing too much uh, sins hmm. and that's why it went it went it went black hmm. okay yeah. so are you saying that when you commit sin you turn black no, no, no. That stone turned black. That stone was pure. The same, like, the same. Okay, the stone was white, right? Milk. Milk color, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the stone was white, and because people, they touch it, and people, they have sin, the black stone became uh, black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Allah. So, Allah so, so your God teaching you that, uh, you know, that by committing sin, you turn black. No, 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 no. This is only for one that stone alone. That yeah, stone this is the only stone. Okay, we, we who cares? Not for all of us. Okay, no, all no, no, the stone, the stone. Focus with me, focus with me. So, this is stone. This is stone. Yeah. You, you must have you commit sin. You put your head inside the vagina of the stone. You kiss it. No, the stone, the, the, the stone or vagina will vacuum, will suck your sin, correct? And that will make the stone black. No, no, no. That's if people committed sins. That's when it turned black over okay. thousands of thousands. So of it's people is it okay? Sins. Is it true that because women they used to put their hand in their vagina and place it on the black stone? Oh come on! You talking tallies now? Come on, CP man! You talking about sex all the time, man? Well, this, this is, is your religion. Not true. You Christians, you Christians got nothing else but to talk about sex. David Ward, Sam Shimon, they talk dirty. Look, if, if uh, you was a good person, yeah, you'll you'll talk clean. All all you do, you talking about vaginas. Come Thank on, you. isn't this what your bloody Jesus? 
Oh, you. Thank you, thank you. You just said you, you see, just you just said we are talking about sex when we talk about Islam because when, because but Islam vagina, is not, you talk because about Islam all time. Vagina, vagina. Okay, let us let us. It's not me who said that. It's not me who said that. I will show you, Abdul. I will show you your Islamic tafsir. What do you say? What? Forget this vagina talk. We got more important things. I will show you your Islamic tafsir. What say you? Answer me this question, yeah. Answer, answer, answer. answer I'm this asking question, you. Yeah? Let us see who what? is the one who keeps talking about vagina. I'm I don't just, talk about vagina. I'm just reading. I'm just reading for you. Um, I don't what? talk about vagina. Let's talk about more important. That, well, the well, truth. Uh, 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 I'm asking you. Why you want to talk about vaginas for? Why? CP, man. It's you, you Muslim who say it's, it is you. I'm reading what you Muslim say. Why you Muslim? No. You... Okay, look what I don't happened. Talk about vagina. Look what you just I, did. I, look I look what you just did. You just said. You just said that we keep talking about sex when we are just quoting your prophet. No, no, no. There's no such thing as a vagina being near the Kaaba. You know that as well, yeah? Okay, the so... The Kaaba why... is the first place of worship. Is the first place of worship. All right, here we From... go. I'm going to give you a link in front of everybody. Actually, here we go. Let me put it in the screen. You know? And this is a link. And this is Tafsir Al-Hawi. You know, this is not a Christian tafsir. This is not a you know a Hindu tafsir. This is a pure Islamic tafsir. Tafsir Hawi is very well known. Let me give you the link. You can open it and you can use Google Translation. I know that you are uh, you know a potato. I do not know anything about Arabic. Let us tell. I will send you the link. Let us see. Uh, what is to send you the link? CP. I don't know about vaginas. I, I want to know the truth. My friend, the my truth, friend, this is your tafsir saying that, that women, women, they go around the Kaaba and they place yeah. their hand over the, uh, the black stone <coughs> when they have their period. And the purpose, because this is black stone is a sex stone. Uh, so, oh, she, so they will have babies. Here we go. Let us see. I, I will, I will put it in the screen. Give me a second. And I gave you the link already. So you have no excuse. You know, you can use Google Translation if you are an ignorant and like your prophet. Stop coughing. You know, something will happen to you if you cough. The prophet said so. <laughs> yeah, because Genie, he's stuck in your nose and he is going inside Listen. your mouth now. And he pissing in your ears. Okay, hold on, hold on. So this hold is the on, tafsir. On. I sent you the link. Did you open the link? Did you open the link? Read with me carefully. وجاء جبريل بالحجر الأسود من السماء وقيل تمخض أبو قويس فانشق عنه جبريل he brought the stone the black stone from the sky and it says that Abu Qubais which is a little tiny mountain next to the Kaaba uh, uh, you know he gave birth to it he gave delivery which, which was hidden inside it during the, the, the flood of Noah and it was a white pearl from the heaven but when and when the blood of period touch it in the time of Jahiliya, it became black. <laughs> anyway, this That's is bloody Arabic, man. That's Arabic, man. I don't, I didn't Who cares? Read, 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 use Google Translation. Come on, man. The point English be easy for us to all read. We don't know the Arabic, man. Well, the website is not. I don't have. Do you have a Hawi in English? No, no. But this is Arabic, man. I don't, I don't know Arabic. I just want to read it only. We can, only we can, it. we can use translation English, uh, Google translation. Peace be upon him. Peace be upon him. What? Uh, well, you uh, Google translation is better than you. Don't God. show me anything in Arabic. Don't show me anything uh, Arabic. Cause I don't, I don't know. How Here to, we how go. To this is. Arabic. I will use Google translation in front of everybody. Translate to English. Here we go. Tafsir al Hawi. And this is the page number. This is the value number, etc. Surat al-Baqarah, verse number one two six. We go down. Let us search for the black stone. Black. CP. After this, I I, I want to go through one small. Here we go. Read with me in, in English. In English, Abdul. Here we go. So Jibril came with the black stone from the sky. It was said. That Abu Qubais, which is a little tiny mountain next to the Kaaba, gave birth to it, and then it was hidden during the days of uh, uh, of the flood of Noah, and it was white like pearl from paradise, and when the menstruation touched it during the pre-Islamic area, it turned to be black. Hmm. 
So now you have no excuse to say I don't know Arabic. So when the administration touch it, how the administration of Muslim women touch it? Said Abu Kader and spelling hidden in the station to state. But what's the, what's the, what's the context of this? This is the explain, explain what context. Here's the whole context. It Even is, this one need a context. Is, Don't make me hang up on say, you. It does, does not it, say women. It does not say any women. Oh, uh, okay. So, menstruation of cows. What's the. What, Ministration the... of what? Okay, hold on. You you speak English very well. This is ministration of what? Uh, donkeys, cows. Ministrations have got any uh, words for ministration. Ministration? No, it says al al hayd. Al hayd is the ministration of blood. You know, when vagina bleed. So ministration is it a cow or women? I I you know for me if you ask me you better say women. That would be embarrassing if it's cows. Mental religion. You Muslims, you worship stones. You claim you worship Allah. It's a it's a vagina stone, full of women blood from from uh, menstruation. Well, this is the first time I've seen it. Anyway, it's first time I've seen this. But that's not. But but this does not mean this does not this this thing here does not. Listen, mean, listen, listen. We have wrong. a person who is Come expert. On. We have a person who is expert in menstruation. His name is Ibn Faru. Why you don't call him right now and let him join the call with us? She is good. Call her, Sheikh Uthman. She have menstruation since she 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 learned about me. She have always menstruation. You are a man, so she will not be alone alone with me. And there is no reason to be afraid. Is, you will protect her. But listen, CP. Yeah, mm. this is not important in Islam. This is not important for me. It's important. This is mental illness God. because this is always mental well, illness. The okay. truth is, so the, the truth the is, truth... Yeah, you are a Christian. Mm. You are a Christian, and now, Hosin, it's my duty to show you evidence as well. So please, can we go to Isaiah twenty-one? Hey, we we talk about 21. Isaiah last time. Listen, Abdul, Isaiah boy. No, listen. no, 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 no. Listen, you see the topic today. Is Islam is a mental the vagina. illness? I don't have a vagina. You, you, you are you are a follower of a what vagina. So why you put your head inside of a vagina? Then if you don't follow it's a vagina, not a vagina is a kaaba. Okay, it's so a why? Okay, explain to us why it look like a vagina. Anything can look like a vagina. Anything can look like a design of a vagina. What wow. do you mean? What do you mean? Vagina. What do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, explain. What do you mean? Does it look like a vagina or not? No, 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 no vagina. Okay, no. I'm going to put the black stone in the screen. And everybody will see if this is true or not. Here this, we go. Yeah, this is where you Christians are. Yeah, you've got no uh, argument. You have to bring these stupid arguments along. Well, my friend, I, I just gave you reference from your books, right? So, and you are saying to me stupid argument. It is you Muslims who are saying that blood of menstruation, maybe, maybe the stone itself is heavy menstruation. What do you think? No, 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 no. What do you mean, no, no, no? So no. where is the menstruation coming from? You need to explain Allah to me. You have when, to go for the hadith. When your, Listen, when your yeah, you scholars, know, here we go. I know. Here we you go. Let's, let us let us put it on the screen. Everybody will laugh because you are trying to, you know, run away from the truth. That's you Muslims. You know, you have a weird, silly religion. Here we go. Does it look like a vagina or not? Why you are a silence? You know, you've been there, you put your head inside, now you don't remember it? I know the, the stone, the cornerstone, that's all it is, a cornerstone. Okay, it's a, it's a cornerstone in the shape of what? Eh? In the shape Nothing. of what? It's a stone, it doesn't matter what shape it is. It, it, <clears throat> so it you agree? What shape is. <clears throat> so, no. so you agree, it is in the it's, a, it, it, it's in the shape of a vagina? No, it's not. And you must tell me you put your head inside it. No, 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 no. What that's... do you mean? No, 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 no. So here we go. Everybody, everybody can see it. Everybody can see it, my friend. You stop running away from the truth. You know, reality, reality. Check. <laughs> Come on, see, you got a better argument, than this man. What's this argument about, man? Okay, it's so no, but now because now we have a blood different period, you said it's not from women. So obviously, this is the black stone was having menstruation. It's a vagina. No, <coughs> no. no. 
not vagina at all. Okay, where is the where is the blood of the period coming from? As we showed you from Tafsir al Hawi, as you see, this is your Islamic books. Why you Muslim lie to us? So you must you say you know so, is, yeah, so CPM, you Muslims we, in Tafsir. So no. you Muslim in Tafsir. You lie to Christians. We you have say to, to go. Them, we have to go to the scholars, teachers to make sure what's the interpretation of this verse. You can't just read and think, oh, it means this. No, 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 no. You need to know the full. So why you story. are why you are calling me if you don't have an answer for nothing? So you are because I never I never called you for each time you, I asked you. Vagina. Look look at you. You know you are expert with Isaiah forty two, but you know nothing about your religion. The vagina. I don't talk about no bloody uh, vagina. Crap. Okay, take care. Let us take the second Muslim. I have no time for kids. Let us see. If there is any Muslim, it's a mentally ill religion. It's calling again. Okay, listen. If you want to stay with me, then call a scholar. Can you call Sheikh? Uh, you know, you claim that uh, uh, Mimi Hijab is a warrior. Can you call the warrior? Who? Mimi Hijab. I'll ask him. I will ask them the, the full. No, you call him right now. You call him right now. Why are you afraid? Ha what will happen to him? Nothing will happen I to him. I promise you. I, I haven't got contact details. I'm, I'm, I'm going to contact. Okay, details. no, no, now, now, to... now you can call and you can join the conversation with us. Call Mimi Hijab and call the t his dates. No, I'm not going to contact and he's not my sheikh anyway. My sheikh is a sheikh Asim Al Hakim. Okay, call him. How many call it from Wembley? Is in a uh, Saudi Arabia? Still, it's still, is, it's still, it's still, he is awake. It's not uh, night time. I've just got his, I've just got his email. I've just got his email. He's a, he's a main sheikh. No, he has a phone number. Source. We have it in the screen. No. We have a phone number. You can call him. Stop lying. You can, you can no, no, no. You cannot, you cannot get through to him. You can't get through now. That he's not gonna answer. No calls from the phone. No, he okay, answers calls. Just... just tell him I will make donation. He will take you right away. <laughs> No, he's 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 rich already. He's rich. He doesn't need donations. Okay, tell him I you, have six, uh, you six years. You Christians all Tell him donations. I have six years old girl. You know she want to get married. Question. See, ask this question here. Yeah. How come you Christians are always asking for donations? You, David Wood, Sam Shimon. I'm not asking. Where? When, when last always time? Always ask for donations. When, when last time you, you, you heard me saying I go live, I go patron, off, I don't, patron. I don't go. Oh, hold, hold on. Please so I, okay, me. I will go with Please you. I will, I will go with you. Come on. I, will go, I, will go, people, I will go with you. The one who asked for donation is a bad person, is he? Here we go. He is using the neighbor internet. Are you there? You are all doing for cash reasons. I'm asking you. The one who if asked for no donation, cash, the one who asked like, for yeah, donation yeah. is bad. Correct. A person who's asking for uh, things like, like that. Yeah. I yeah. think it's wrong. I think it's wrong. Yeah, so, okay, so why you mean hijab right away after the debate with David Wood? He says, we are defending Islam, him and his sister, uh, uh, his boyfriend, Ali Dawa. They said, who gave Allah a mortgage, a good mortgage, and will you give it to who? You give it to me, hijab. And he was reading the Quran. So you just admitted that Islam is a stupid religion and Allah is bad because no, he, no, no, no. the first one who asked for a mortgage you is Allah. Did Allah no, ask no, for no. a mortgage? You law. You Christians did, ask for did, cash did just Allah, to attack did Allah, Islam. That's the wrong did way. Allah, That's the wrong way. Abdul, did Allah ask for a mortgage? Yes or no? No. He says a he says a loan just 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 pen in the way of Allah. That's what he says. Okay, yeah, a loan which will never be paid off. You know, I mean, a loan. No, Allah will yes, pay you back in heaven. It will do. It okay, will why do. Allah? It will if do. He is God, Jannah. if Allah is God, why he yeah. need the mortgage? Yeah. He did not need mortgage. He did not need cash. He's saying, give to those that are working in the way of... No, he, the one who Allah. collect the money is Muhammad and Muhammad only. So who is the one who will give Allah Uth, a goodly loan? Uth, Obviously, Uth, Muhammad Uthman, is the goodly Uth, God. Uth, Uth, Uthman Farouk, Uth, Uthman Farouk hmm. asked for no cash. He, he does his work for free. No, go to his website. You, you will see it says free. donate you there. Go to his website. Such Don't be stupid. On, yeah, I made no, a video no, about no. it. Actually, you go there. You will see it says donate, he, please. It says donate, please. I don't say donate, please. I actually, I just block a bunch of people in my in my page who is making donations just because they are saying stupid things. So I don't say donate, please. I don't kiss I don't kiss hands and shoes for people to donate to me. You Muslim, you do that starting from your prophet. Even your God, Allah, no. He is not God. Because if God is Allah is God, He can He can hit the ground and turn the ground into gold. 
What kind of God he need to beg for money? You tell me. You answer this question, yeah. Hmm. God said to the Arabs, yeah, in the Quran, hmm. God told the Arabs, yeah, do not let no pagans in this city of, of holy city and I will make you rich. He said in the Quran, I'm going to make you rich. How and he will make you rich? No, he this, did not make you rich. He said, happened. no, he, no. He made the Arabs rich. No, the, Today, look, the Arabs are no, rich. No, 90 per, 99 percent of the Arab are very poor. Secondly, which, which, which countries are Let me count for you. Let, Saudi, me, let me count for you. Arabia. Yeah, even Saudi Arabia is poor because 90 percent, 90 percent of the, the Saudi until now in Saudi Arabia they didn't no. even have a sewage. Most of the streets you, you, are you, you most of the streets are listen. dirt. You never been in Saudi Arabia did, and you are needed. You are a liar. Then you never been in Saudi Arabia. What did go, I see? Go in Saudi Arabia. You? you will see how many people in the street know, begging, but, begging for money, but, homeless. You know, explain, just hold on, hold on, hold on. Somalia, Yemen, Syria, Iraq, all of you, you no. became refugee. You yourself, you are a refugee, aren't you? No, 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 no. How you came, no, no, how, no, how no, you come to the UK? Hey, eh? who said, who said I'm from the UK? Where are you now? <laughs> Where are you, CP? Where are you? Okay, okay listen, I am <laughs> in the USA. I am in the USA. I did not come here as a refugee, you, you know. CP. Hmm. Now let us let us focus. In Allah the, let us focus the on the question. Arab let's focus on the leaders. question. Allah He said. Allah said. What Allah He said. Allah never talk. Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. When 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 the Quran in front of us says, "وَإِن تُقْرِضُ اللَّهَ قَرْضًا حَسَنًا." Okay, who is the one is talking? Read the verse for me. Yeah. This is number. This is the chapter sixty four, yeah. verse number seventeen. Who is talking? Which one? Chapter 64, verse number 17. Have you got a screen? Have you got a screen? The verse? Yeah, I have it on the screen. Use camera urine to clean your, your screen. I'm waiting. Who is the one is talking? This is this is not this is not a verse I'm on about. Who is the one is talking? Wait. If you lend to Allah, good loan. Allah. Okay. So how Allah He says, and Allah's if you one. if you lend Allah a good loan, why He did not say if you lend me? No, he's saying if you if you if you lend me a good loan. Where where is the word me? Where you, is the word me? Lend, are you are you corrupting your book now? Is there enough what is corrupted already? No. Okay, read with me. No, it says no. if you lend Allah a goodly line. Where where is the word me? Lend me. And then he says he will double. He who. He says if you if you lend Allah a goodly loan, yeah. 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 Okay. What does that me mean? Who is talking? What, is, what does that mean? Who is talking? Allah. Okay, Allah, why, why okay. Allah is saying if you lend Allah if he is Allah? Because uh, because what he's trying to say to you is if if you if you lend if you if you if you lend Allah. We got the point of Allah. about lending, Abdul. We got the point. If you lend, we got we got that. We got that. But why he is saying yeah. if you lend Allah if he is Allah? Yeah. Okay. Because he's saying if you yeah that is him. What he's talking about himself. Allah. If Allah is talking, he should say if you lend me a goodly loan. I will double it for you. It says here he will double it for you. So the one is making the verse here obviously is not the one who is supposed to. Allah he is Allah saying to the world, to the world, if you lend. We get Allah, it to the so world, yeah, the word of the idiot. Okay. So if you if you give thing. Allah, if you give Allah a good line alone, but who is the one saying that yeah. Allah? How Allah he is speaking? Okay, but that's mean you have many Allah. Okay, well, that's mean maybe. No, there's only one. Do, he's talking about do you himself. Think, do you he's think talking about himself? Talking about himself, he called himself he's Allah. He's talking about himself. Yeah, he, he is. So he I am is, a Christian is, prince. I say, is. if you give a Christian prince donation, I am a Christian prince. He, no, he if uh, if uh, you say if if you say to your people if you donate a Christian prince, hmm. same thing you are talking. But here yourself. it says he will double it for you. He. Yeah, he. So I will yeah, I will call myself by saying he. No, but that's Allah calls himself by he. What's he, wrong? He. What's wrong with your God? Is he mentally ill? Like Lucky didn't speak. No, he's not mentally ill. He said it. Pure words, the pure words. Do he speak? He lend, okay, what kind? What kind of a pure or word he says to himself? He, uh, what is that? 
And there's nothing, nothing, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, okay. Nothing wrong with that. All come right. on, Christian, please. Okay, let's, hold, let's hold go on. to the verse. Okay, hold let's on. go to the verse where... No, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. So, Allah is one God. Is he one or two or three or four? One. So, if Allah want to take a partner, he said he will take the partner from us. Us who? To the creation. Allah will take partner from the creation? But he won't do. What? He won't do. What? He won't do. He will never take a creation from uh, from any. Okay, anybody. read no. for me chapter 21, verse number 17. Just to show you, Islam is, is a sign of mental illness. Your Muslim keeps saying he is one God, one God, one God. And then he says, if I want to have a sex with the, with, the, with the partner, I will take her from us. Allah is her. Have you got a screen? The verse? Yeah, it's in the screen. We could show a chicken of us. Until you answer, let me answer this idiot here. Somebody said. Do you know that the Catholic Church pray for the dead? You idiot, they are not praying for the dead because they believe they are resurrected. So you are mentally ill. This is what happened when a donkey, he opened his mouth. They speak nothing but a donkey language. When they pray for the dead, you are because you are ignorant. They believe they are resurrected. Even the Bible says when Jesus resurrected, all the saints were resurrected with him. So you are a certified donkey. Now, what is the answer, my friend Abdul? We're with that. We're with that. We're there. We're the verse now. Chapter 21, verse number 17. Stop drinking camel urine. You are slowing too much these days. Uh, how do we let it take a diversion? Why you don't call one of those girls in YouTube? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. So he's saying. So Allah will take partner. He will take a wife. He said from us. Do Allah have a cousin? Maybe Allah will marry his cousin. You think so? Is it a twenty-one? What's wrong yeah? with you? How many times I have to repeat the same verse? Chapter twenty-one, verse number seventeen. I am reading that. Okay, so Allah want to take a wife for boom boom. Allah will take a wife. Don't tell me that Allah. He says us. We will take it from us. Okay, do Allah have a cousin, maybe? Maybe this is his cousin, because the Arab, they marry their cousin. What do you think, this uh, this woman, who is she? And she is from us. That's mean there's many of them. There's many Allah. No, he's he's saying that if he wanted a wife, yeah. he could have took it from the creation, but he's not, not going to. What is the yes, word, the creation? Yes. What is the word, the creation? He said us. Us is a creation now? That would make it more horrible. That's mean Allah is a created himself too. He's a creation himself. If you if you are saying the word us is a creation, or he take a partner from creation, he said from us. That means he's one of the creations too. He says he says the Yusuf Ali one. He says nearest to us, nearest to us. There is what? He says. We could have taken the things nearest to us. It, it, what is that? Yusuf Ali uh, translation. Of How is Yusuf Ali doing, by the way? Is he alive still? No, no, he passed away. Because he I didn't know Yusuf Ali has looked like an idiot. I mean, it, it says here in Arabic. I don't think this guy speaks Arabic. If we want to take a woman for fun, for boom, boom, we will take it from ourselves. Very simple. So, what uh, creation? What etc. What close to us? What is that? It says from us. We could surely have taken it from us. Mm. We, should, we could. We could surely have taken it from us mm -hmm. if we went. Yeah, repeat that word quite uh, ten times. Maybe you will get it better. We surely have taken it. Yeah, repeat it more, brother. More. <laughs> we could have surely taken it from us. Uh huh. Who us? So why? Who's us? Us. Us. Us is him. Allah. Uh, uh, us as him. So Allah will uh, Allah yeah. will have sex with himself? 
No, no. He's saying that if he wanted to take a wife, he could, he would have he would have taken it. Simple as that. Yeah, taken from who? Taken from who? Don't stop. Taking it from us. So he will take the wife from where? From us. So Allah is a wife too. No. He's a lesbian. <laughs> that desire to take, take to us a diversion. We, we could surely have taken it from us. Hmm. From us. We, we, we could have taken it from us. Uh huh. From us. From Taking us, it. not us. From us. Taking it from us. Uh huh. Are you going to repeat it until I tomorrow? I don't, I, don't, I don't know the meaning. I don't know the meaning of that verse. Why you don't yeah, call yeah, the yeah. Why you don't call the tit boy? Because he is a specialist <laughs> with the, with the, with tits. No, well, honestly, no, he no, have no. a specialty with tits. You know, he wanna suck the the women the breast. He the guy is a specialist, and he wanna wage war in China by showing his tits. He's a warrior, you know. But he don't dare even to speak to me. So why you don't call him right he now? He wants to speak. Oh, there, there, there. Wants Ibn, Ibn, Ibn. Ibn. Okay, prove, prove me wrong. Call him right now. Let him join the conversation. Eh? Eh? CP, come on. You got a bit arguments of this. Ibn, this Ibn, 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 Ibn. Okay, all of you. All, of, all, 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 all those Muslims are potatoes, CP, including on. you. Look at you. Here we go. You keep repeating saying from us, from us, from us. Are you going to repeat that? Just from call us. Call a shake no, for me. Call a shake. Call a shake. Let him explain how in the world this is happening. Allah will take a partner, and the partner is a female, and she will be from us. Take it from us, isn't it? Yeah, that's mean Allah and all everybody around him. They are females too. No. Well, he says he will take a partner from us. He says taking it from us, but you don't know the truth. Meaning of that. We, we, okay, it says there, verse. it says even in your translation, i.e. a wife or a son, so he will take a wife, so she will have, give him a baby. Okay, 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 okay. Have you read a commentary on that, on that verse first? I did read the commentary. read the commentary. If you don't read a commentary, the comment, how do you know? The commentary how, is how more horrible. The commentary is more horrible. No, it says that Allah, no, no, no. it says Allah will have sex with Jibreel. What say you? Is it true? Allah will have sex with Jibreel? No, 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 no. Okay, let us go. You are the one who mentioned the word documentary word, not me. So don't be, uh, don't cry or fly. You know, this is your choice. Here we go. We will go to a commentary about the verse. Here we go. It says, if we wanted to have, uh, uh, you know, a partner, the partner here, it says, from ourselves, this is the Jalalain, we found it from ourselves, from the beautiful eyed Huris or the angels. Read it. Mental religion, mentally ill, sex, stupid religion. So now you try to fix it. You asked me to read the commentary, and now we are in trouble more. Our, it's not us no more, it's ourselves. Here we go. Solve this problem now. We, we, we were with us, now we end with ourselves. And this is the verse after explanation now. Ourselves mean... The black-eyed Huris and the angel Jibreel or the angels will have sex with them. Allah will have sex with the angels or the black, the black-eyed women. And this is this is ourselves. Child, you, you would have found it from ourselves with blue-eyed Huris or angels. Mm. You know what? I would love to see Jibreel getting breathed from Allah and he have nine months like Billy. I'm gonna buy it. How how Jibreel will end to be the wife of Allah? You tell me. Help me. It says the angels. Do, no, do it says uh, at the end, at the end, at the end part. It says, but we did not desire it. We could have. He said, are we? we okay. Well, he said, if, if we. Angels, okay, hold on. But, but we, we don't desire. desire it. Okay. So, but it's uh, but it's still still that one has solved the problem. Maybe maybe this is fourteen hundred years ago. Maybe now he's horny. This is another question. The question is, if we want to take a partner, we will find it from ourselves. Who's ourselves? Black-eyed women or the angels. So, do you Muslims is the angels are male or female? Nothing. What, what do you mean nothing? The angels are not male or not female. So, why your God Allah says they are not females; they are male. Who's who's are angels? Where where did they say that the? What's wrong with the Muslims? Each time I say something to them, they say where, where I never heard say, this before. No, where did they say that the? Here we go. Allah, are, uh, Allah is Muslims. angry. Allah is angry because the, the, the Arab, they say that the, the angels are females when they are not. Here we go. 
And here we go, read it. Chapter Where? chapter 17, verse number 40. They are male, not females. Well, I don't like men just to be females. Not on the screen. Complete. Turn the screen, please. Chapter 17, verse number 14. Actually, here the translation is making it even more horrible. It says, Hath your Lord designate, dis distinguished you between two brackets, O men of Mecca, by giving you sons, he is a boy, you mean boys, and has it chosen for him, sir, females from among the angels? What does that mean? There's females angels. Uh, what's, they are male angels. Yeah. What does that mean? You tell me. Here it says that there is female angels, actually. But there is many angels, but they are there is females. Oh, but if you read the if you, if, you, if you read the end part, it says you are uttering nonsense. You are uttering lies. Read read the end part. Read it. You read it. Here we go. I'm not. I'm just reading the translation in it front says, of us. It says. Wait, 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 wait there, wait there. It says, "What has your has your Lord favored you with sons and has taken for himself daughters from amongst the angels? You are indeed." uttering a monstrous lie so the people were so mm. the people were accusing mm. so what allah said to them you are uttering nonsense you okay what they said what what wish. the people said what the people said it, they said they, they, they said that uh, your lord has favored you with sons and has taken for himself daughters from amongst the angels mm. that's what the what does that mean? You can be repeating the same thing. Are you going to repeat it tomorrow? What does that mean? Explain to me. That means that the pagans were pagans were accusing this. Accusing. Ac accusing. That's not a good one. Accusing. They were accusing. Accusing. Who? So. Accusing whom? What? Yeah. It's the angels. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the pagans were saying the pagans were saying to uh, were saying that the Lord has taken daughters amongst the angels. Okay. And what Allah so, said to them? What Allah said to them? Allah saying you are uttering a monstrous lie. You are lying. You're talking rubbish. You're talking mm. all rubbish. Mm. That's what he's saying to him. He's saying to okay, so what, like, is, so what does that mean? What does that mean? Does it does so it do Allah deny that there's no female angels or he confirmed? Yeah. There's no female he's, angel, right? Yeah, no, 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 there is none. No, 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 okay. no. He's saying to him, You're uttering Okay, a so there's no lie. female angels. So what they are they are they male? Nothing. No, they're not male, they're not female in Islam. The angels are not fair, uh, male or female. Only the jinns are Jinns are human like humans, male, female, but the angels are not. Okay, okay. So why it says if we go in the Quran right now and we search for the story about Jibreel, it says it is he. Well, is he? Okay, so is it he or she? No, no, no. Allah Allah calls himself he, but that, no, I'm but talking, that does not mean I'm talking about no, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about Jibreel. When Jibreel he came to Mary in the Quran, did he come as a male or a female? Not well, uh, 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 male. Uh, uh, male. So he's a male. male. Okay, so he's male. No, or he's... but he, no, but he come as a human form, as a male. He did not come like an angel as a male. He come as a human form, like the people of a uh, lot. Okay, people so lot of human. They come okay, human so form. okay, I will go with you. You see, because we are wasting our time. So I'm the angels. So the, an the angels. Time. The angels are not male, not female. Are you confirming no. that? Yes, hundred, hundred. So how Allah will take the angel as a wife then? Is your God yeah. Allah as a gay? It does not say that's what the pagans were saying. That's what pagans were. No, no. Using. Chapter 21, let us go back. It says, We will take it from ourselves. Who? The black eyed women and the angels. So when Allah will have sex with the angels, those angels are male or female? <coughs> <coughs> yeah. Nothing. Nothing. 
What do you nothing. mean nothing? How he, how he will have sex with them then? Because because Allah is not he or she. He's not he or she. No, Allah is he. Like, Always you say he. No, he, 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 he. Allah is not uh, uh, male or not female. He just so, calls himself he. That's oh, so he himself. so he is he is not a male, neither a female, but he like to no. be he. No, no, he just calls himself he. he. Just calls himself like that. Yes, you know. Okay, I'm going with you. Okay, so he this is a fake he. He's not he. He's not. He's not. He's not a. Okay. Real, like a so if male. Allah, if Allah, not a male, neither a female, how he will take a wife from the black-eyed women? A wife of the blue, because because the people were accusing him. The the Christians were saying that Allah uh, has a has a has a son. Jesus, so he. Yeah, what does it have to do with having a wife? The Christian don't believe that God have a wife and then he have a son. That is stupid. This is why the Quran is, you know, when the Quran is speak about the Christians, <laughs> that the, you know, the Christian they say oh, God have a have a girlfriend. That is stupid. We Christian we don't believe in such a thing. And this is additional proof that the one who wrote the Quran is a mental. No, Catholics believe. Catholics believe. That don't that don't go there. God. Don't be stupid. I will I will I will, I will, I will format you as God. like a software. No no Catholic believe in such a thing. Don't lie. Catholics believe Mary is a don't, goddess. Don't 100%, lie. 100%. Don't lie. Mary oh, is a virgin. The, the Catholic, the Protestant, the Orthodox, they call Mary the Virgin Mary. So stop so why, lying. So why? So I'm so asking why you. The, I'm asking so you. Why the Catholics not? No, no, why? The why stupid, when the, the stupid Quran no, say no, that no. Allah did not take a girlfriend, he was refuting who? He was refuting the Christian, right? You, you cut it off. Hmm? Uh, no, 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 no. He's saying. It is you who said to me a second ago the, he was refuting the Christian. You forgot. It's you who said to me because about, the Catholic they believe the Christian Mary. believe. So when Allah he says Allah do not have a girlfriend, right? It, and then he no. says if we want to take a girlfriend, we will take it from ourselves. We got the point. But none of the Christian, none of even the Jews believe in such a thing. No, well, nobody believes that God of the Christian and the Jews have a girlfriend. And actually, he did not even say the word wife. He said girlfriend, sahiba. Which is very insulting. So your God Allah saying, how he can have a son if he don't have a girlfriend? Do you agree with that? How can he have a son when if you don't have a, if he, if you don't have a girlfriend? If he hasn't got a partner, partner. No girlfriend. It says sahiba. Wait, no, no, no. The English translation say partner. Okay, let us go with partner. No problem. Just to make you happy. Partner, yeah, do you feel partner. better now? Yeah, yeah, Muhammad, no, do you feel better? Okay, he, he feel better. That's good. Okay, so how Allah can have a son if you don't have a partner? Solve this problem for me now. No. Yeah, go on. What do you mean? No, is Allah is God? <laughs> no, he's saying that how how can how come Allah have a son when he he have a partner? You yeah, know? we got that. Are you going to repeat this for the coming century? We got that. Don't repeat it again and again and again. We want the answer. So. How Allah can have a son if you don't have a partner? Don't repeat that no more. We got it. So now we're asking you, is Allah God? Yes. Okay. Why he need a wife to have a son? Can't he have a son without having a wife? No, please. Try to... At the end of the day, yeah, that... He has no partner. He has no son. He has nothing this is another like question. That. This is another question. Focus with me, Abdul. Focus. Drink some alcohol. You're in. Listen carefully. It says, "How can Allah? How can you Muslim saying? How can who? You said yeah, to me. Yeah, that, yeah, you yeah. said to me that Allah is talking, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So Allah is saying, yes. "How can? What kind of God? He question what he can do. Your God, Allah Himself, He question His ability. <laughs> what kind of God does God?" <laughs> He himself saying, I cannot do that. How can he not, have a son when he don't have a girlfriend? So Allah is saying to us, he is like what? me and you. He is a, like a, any human. He cannot have a son unless I have a girlfriend. How can you repeat the game? How, how, read, read for me how again, because I like it when you say how, how, he's, how, he's how. Trying how. To what is that? What happened to you? How? 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 How can he? What's What's wrong with you? you yeah. How can he? Allah. Uh, what kind got, of God? He say. That. How can he? If the God Himself question His ability, how we can believe for a second that He is God? 
He's not questioning his ability. Well, he's, he's not asking how can he... he tried to say to... No, because he tried quite... He's telling you a lot that how can God have a son? How can God have a wife? He's stupid. He's telling you Christians that you lost... Okay, I will Idiots. go with you. But this it's more stupid to say then that how I can have a son if I don't have a girlfriend because the because the Christian don't believe that God have a wife. <laughs> and isn't your Quran saying that Mary she have a son without a, without a boyfriend? So this is a stupid answer. No. The same book how it's called the, the same book of the Muhammad and says that Mary she was a virgin. So what does have to do with this? The same book, the same stupid book, it's called the Quran. Say, Mary, she never been touched by a man. So when the stupid God is saying, how can I have a son when I have a girlfriend? That's mean he don't agree that Mary, she was having a son without a boyfriend because he cannot even make himself have a son. So how he can make Mary have a son without a boyfriend? So here your God is the question is a bit is stupid mental. No, not So how in case, like, do the Christian believe that God took Mary as a as a wife? No, 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 no. Okay, no. so what does what does his stupid answer for? How can he have a son when he did not take a girlfriend? He was answering who? To Christians. <laughs> we just say that the Christian don't believe that God have a wife. <laughs> oh, he's Secondly, you, you. secondly, if I oh say this is an answer can be said by me, by you, because we are a human, we have limited ability, a man alone cannot have a son, very simple. But yeah. when we talk about God, then we say that there's God himself yeah. talking, not somebody else talking about him. How can he have a son when he doesn't have a girlfriend? That means he cannot have a son unless he have a girlfriend. Yeah, he, he's, trying to tell, he's trying to say to you, Christians, that he has no partner, he has no wife. Yeah, but no, nothing. this is not yeah, about the no. He uh, hold on. But the other verse oh said the word. other verse saying that if Allah He want to take a partner, He will take it from ourselves. He can't do. He said. He said he can. He he can if he wants, but he will not because he's not. He's okay. not the creation. He God. Okay, he I will go. I will go with you, on. guys. Did he say he can do so? Did you say he can do so? No. He. You just said he can do so. So it is possible, Allah, he can do it. Good Allah. Hey Allah, take off your pant. So Allah, he can do it. He can do what? He can he have sex. No, no, no. Hold on, it's everybody heard you. Everybody heard you saying. So he can do it. He can do what? He yeah. will take He will take a partner from the beautiful eyed horries. Let's stop with this beautiful eyed horries. I thought those are a human. They are made for sex for the Muslim men. Look like Allah is already playing around with them. No, it's not. It's not around him. No. Well, how then? No. How, how it is possible for God to have a partner? She is a human from the who is in heaven, unless he's a human too. He's trying to say to you lot that he can have anything he wants. You know, I like it when you no. say he's trying to say, guys. Did you hear it? Allah trying to say. Did he? Did he no, succeed? He's trying to say. Did he succeed in his try? Obviously, this book written Allah by stupid. Says, you, look how confused Allah you are. Allah you. trying. Get, well, keep no, trying. Let me answer. So let me answer. Allah, He's Allah, saying, if oh, you want to take a partner, He will take a partner from the women who have nice asses. May Allah ask you. He have nice legs and their vagina is wonderful, as He described in the hadith. So those yeah. are not made for the Muslim men. Maybe Allah already is using them. Allah is saying he can have a partner if he wants, but he will not. Simple as okay. that. CP, Very okay. Simple Come as on, that. Man. No problem. No problem. He said he did not say it. He did not say he did not. He says we don't have desire, which means it's still possible if he in the future change desire. Maybe he will take some Viagra or something. But look what happened now. So when Allah, he said, if I want to take a partner, we'll take it from ourselves. We confirm two things. Allah is not one because the partner is other individual for sure. It cannot be the same person. Do we agree? What? Well, the partner? When Allah He says ourself, Allah confirm that there is not only one individual, his name is Allah. There's from his kind, there's many. Yeah. No. You just said, yeah, it's, everybody it's, heard you. Allah is he saying he's 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 one, he does not say he's a uh, many. Abdul, no, no, no. Abdul, listen that. carefully. Go focus on. with me, focus Go with on. me. Take take Go your on. finger from your nose. Listen carefully. We would have found it with ourselves. Okay. Allah is looking for a for a for a partner. He will find it where ourselves, right? Among ourselves, gone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, so I agree. So Allah will fight with ourselves. Is Allah looking inside Himself? Is that no. inside His belly? I mean, from amongst us. Yeah, um, yeah, ourselves. Who are they? Those um, ourselves. I don't know. I don't know. CP. I don't know. I need. I need. I need. I need. I need to go to find out this verse properly. Why you don't Could call? He... Okay, I have a solution for you. It is in England. It's daytime. Call the tit boy. He can help you. This guy is strong. He will take his T-shirt. He will take his T-shirt off to scare me. Come on, I will be scared. I will be terrified. Honestly, why you don't call him? What's the problem? Why am I calling for? I don't need, need him. I don't need him at all. I don't. Oh, need you, him. you are the one who said to me he is a whatever. Uh, 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 you said what? He's a warrior. So he's call, he's okay, a call the warrior. Girl. Islam. He's a warrior in Islam. There's what no warrior? Christian. This guy. He never did jihad. Islam. He never carry a gun. No, he never carry a sword. No Listen, he carry his CP, tits. He yeah. is a potato. CP, he is a potato. CP. Hold on. Question. Hold answer, on. Answer, I was. Answer, I was. Answer, hold on. A potato. Don't let me talk. I was in the army. I was. I was in the army. I served in the army. When you say a warrior is. A warrior. This is what warrior mean. A warrior is not a guy go in the street, take off his t-shirt. He's a. <laughs> he is. He is. He's like a soldier. Yeah, he's a soldier, soldier. By, by taking he's off his t-shirt. So you know, imagine we go to war, we take off our t-shirt, guys. <laughs> all right, all right. CP, CP, answer, answer, answer me this question. Answer, answer, answer me this one question. So hold on, yeah? answer, answer, hold on. answer me this one okay, question. So no, no. Listen, let me answer me, please. Are you going to take off your t-shirt too? Are you a warrior? Please, no. Please answer me this are one, one question. Hmm. Eh? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. You are not. I'm so not you are wearing is. your t-shirt no. still. Thanks to Allah. Yeah, it's cold. It's cold. Is is winter, obviously. But answer, uh -huh. but answer me this question here. Yeah? Uh -huh. Why are your Why are your churches closing in thousands? In the West, well, as I know, thousands of churches are closed. Uh, Abdul, as I know, it is the opposite. You Muslims are no, 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 no. It's all, it's, it's, it's proven. My friend, go watch now the video of Mimi Hijab and Ali Dawa. They said more than 176,000 something. They left Islam just in in the last year in Europe alone. Churches are closing. Do I see the well, closing? I don't know. They are lying. Then, uh, according to Jazeera TV, news. according to Jazeera TV, CP. no, my, my friend. Not, Okay, uh, maybe. It's on the news. Okay, I will tell you. I will tell you. I, I will. I will give you even an allegation of a church is a close because they are getting bigger. Some BBC they news, are getting, Sky they are news, getting everywhere. Bigger. Maybe uh, this is in Europe. We don't have a. You see, Abdul, it, you Muslim too. You are living Islam. Muslim girlfriends, boyfriends. I mean, you go night the club is full of Muslims. So where is the most? No, 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 no. no now no, listen no. carefully. I don't care about all those words you are saying. Allah is not one. The one who wrote. Allah the Quran, is one. The, no, one no. Who wrote the, Quran is, is one. the one who wrote the Quran is a stupid and 16,000 no. Muslims live in Islam a day according to Al Jazeera TV. Why? Because nobody can answer our questions. Easy, I've answered the questions. You said the us, he, six we. Millions, six millions a year live in Islam according to Al Jazeera no, TV. No. So now I'm asking you, Islam is can you answer? Okay, the then world. answer. Here we Islam go. I challenge in the front world. of you. I challenge in the front of you. Very simple. If Allah is one, Allah will take a partner from ourselves how you, you, you feel. No, that's only one verse. That's only one verse. Yeah, Who I, need, I need. Who I need. I need to go on. Uh, so you are saying but all the verse. verses you said to me, I never heard of. No, the angels. The angels. Okay, let me remind you. And, let me the, remind the you when the when, when in, 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 chat, in, in the in the chat about Suleiman, where it says that Suleiman, the genie, they built for him a tamathil. They built for him statues. You were able to answer or not? You said no. Statues of what? No, I did. I. Did I did answer you that question? I said to you that the baby statues, but we but we don't know what. I don't know what statues. Okay, you so don't know what so you was. so you agree you agree that Muslims have a statues, correct? No, that was that was that was in the house of that was in the house of David. Why that Allah is uh, uh, what David? This is Suleiman. Why Allah is asking Suleiman to build statues? Allah Allah did not ask Suleiman. Suleiman no, no, he asked did. The, no, did no he did. Because he did not see that. He did not see that. He did not, he did not no. see that. He says because, uh, Suleiman. Asked okay, are you saying are you building. saying that Suleiman was a bad prophet? No, he wasn't. No, no. So why he is building statues? Statues of what? Why statues he is what? building statues in his synagogue? Listen to me. Statues of what? Of 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 uh, what? We don't know these statues. You don't know. Statues. Doesn't matter. Let us say. Let us are. say it was a statues of a frog. Do you Muslim worship a frog? No, no. Nobody knows what statues are these. Who care about what Nobody they are for? Maybe for tits. Maybe for tits. No problem. There this is not, be, this is be, not the question. Be. Does it say statues? It says a statues. So there are statues for what you do not know. But who care? Maybe statues for vagina. Maybe statues for Allah. Maybe statues for Jibreel. Maybe statues for Christian Prince. Still, you have a statues in the synagogue. Why? 
that was it. That was it. That was it. Israel. I don't know what happened there. But the, who is the one? Is, uh, the no, the main thing is, we, we, you we, see, we, just to show you that Islam, you know, the topic today, Suleiman, Islam is a mental Suleiman, illness. Suleiman Islam is a mental build, illness. Look, uh, the verse before it says that Allah, he gave Suleiman a flying carpet. Just the verse before it. Do you agree that uh, Suleiman have a flying he carpet? Gave powerful do you agree? Do you agree that Suleiman have a flying carpet? He could have. Huh? He could have. He could have. He could do anything. Okay. Allah. So, Suleiman, he, he can have a flying carpet and he can have sex with all his wives in one night to make a baby, but Allah cannot have a cannot have a son without a wife. Allah. Allah says he, 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 he does not need a son. He does not. He's too high to have a son. That's what that's what he says in the Quran. He's too high to have a son. He does not need a sons. Who said who did not? God does. What do you mean? What do you mean he do not need? He he is too high to, to have a son. He's too he's too like you know he's God. He does not know son at all. Hmm. In the in the let me in ask the you. Old Testament, in did, the Old did Testament. Allah, can I, Abdul, can Abdul, I please ask you a question? Abdul, Abdul, can I please ask you a question? Abdul, yeah, please okay. let me ask me uh, one question. Uh, uh, please Abdul, ask me one question. Uh, no, hold on. CP, ask me one question. CP, in the Old Testament, hmm. in the Old Testament, does does God say He has a He has a real son in the Old Testament? He, he have no. what? He have what? He has a He has you know a child. Well, according to your prophet, He does. No, 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 no. He did Here not we go. Child <laughs> the verse Testament. in front of you. Because if I show you from the Old Testament, you will say I don't believe in it anyway. The Jews, the go. Jews will Here not we go. agree Chapter with you. Nine, the Jews, verse the number Jews 30. will not agree with you. Chapter 9, verse number 30 says the Jews believe that there is a guy, his name is Uzair, he is the son of Allah, correct? There was one group. There was one group. Where it the says, where it says the word group. one group? Show me the word. The, show me the, the word the, one the group. Islamic scholars have said, the Islamic Abdul, scholars have answered this verse. Well, they've how, answered this are verse. They, are they changing the Quran? This, it says the Jews. doesn't say one Jew, two Jews, ten Jews. It says there are certain Jews who are in, who are in you know, Arabia. Show me, where it says, Arabia. show me where it says certain Jews. It says the Jews and the Christians. It says the Jews, yeah. The, yeah. The so Jews that's mean, that kind. The, so that's mean all the Jews. No, 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 no. It does not so say all Jews. That means the verse Jews, is wrong because if it's not all the Jews, he should not say all the Jews. It's not say the Jews. No, he the say, Jews. He should say some some of the Jews. Say says Jews, and then they say Jews. There, there was a group of Jews. Abdul, in Abdul. Arabia. If Allah want to take a son, is that possible? He can do if he wants, but he will never. He will never do it. Okay. He, he can do, but okay. he won't. He uh -huh. won't. He's not stupid. Uh -huh. How can God have a son? All right. How can God have a son? Come okay. on, see. I, I, I want to. I want you to read this verse for me. Chapter thirty-nine, verse number four. Yeah, go on. Mm. Wait, wait. Yeah, it says, it says, if if he if he wanted a son, hmm. he could have. Hmm. He could have. How he can do that? He could have. Any any in any way. He could have taken he could have had a son. Okay, if, so uh, it's easy. Son, it's easy for Allah to take a son, right? He can you can Hello? No, he won't. Yeah, but he, he okay, but, but it's he, easy. It's easy, right? If he wished, yeah. if he wished, Hello? right? If he wished. If he says if he wanted to, it's the same thing, wished or wanted to. Okay. If he wanted so, to take a son, so how, he could. So how, he how is stupid? How is stupid it is to say in other verse, if Allah wants to have a son, he will. He will. T he. He. Will, how he can have a son if he don't have a girlfriend? <laughs> why? Why? No, he, he said it's why he put, same thing. Why, hold on, Abdul. He said if Allah want to take a son, he will take it from the girlfriend, right? Okay. So if Allah want to take a son, he will take it from who? From the girlfriend, he would, you know, he, how he can have a son? He don't have a girlfriend. If he don't have a girlfriend, yeah. he cannot have a son. Do we agree? You cannot, you cannot, you cannot have a, yeah, yeah, go on, go on, go on. Okay, but this verse means, this is verse is stupid then, because here it says, why, if, he wished, he, if he wished, he can. Yeah, if he, okay. it says, if he wished, no, let me answer this. It says, it says, if he wished, he could then, take a wife or a girlfriend he doesn't want to no he, he no, has no read carefully girlfriend. read carefully it oh says if word. he wished if he wished to take for himself a son he will take it yeah. from the from the creation he create he did not here yeah. there's no no need for a wife 
<laughs> no, he he's saying to you he could take it from the from the creation of a son. A son, yeah, exactly. A son, yeah, squeeze it. So if you want to take a son, it's easy. If you wish, he take it from the creation. That means he does not need a wife in the middle. What does so, that mean? So what, what does that, that mean? So what that, that stupid creation? verse that that stupid what? verse mean? No. If Allah wanted, See, how Allah can have a son if he doesn't have a girlfriend? <laughs> no, he's trying to say to you. He's trying to say to you, stupid Christians, that he can take a son. By having a wife in the creation, <laughs> but the Christians don't believe that. And have a but son the Christians don't believe that Jesus is the Son of God because God He married from Mary. That is a stupid. So you just you know here the stupid author of the Quran is a mentally ill. No, in one verse, he's not saying, mentally ill. In one verse no, says no, that Allah how can have a son if you don't have a girlfriend? In the other verse saying the opposite, Allah can have a son without having a girlfriend. <laughs> no, what he's trying to say to you that he can he can he can have a, a, a girlfriend or wife. He, he he can do amongst the creation, but he won't. He uh, can do this. Okay. He's saying that he could he could do uh, this. Come uh, on, CP, your argument is stupid. You and you know that as well. You know. <laughs> Pagans <laughs> believe in a son of God. This is why the this is why the bloody this is why the bloody Jews hate the Christians. Okay, okay, let, the Jews let, hate okay, the Christians. Let, let me let me make it simple you for you. Their let me let me make it simple for you. Old Testament. You, you, when you believe in Allah, when you believe in Allah, what yeah, uh, what what will happen next? What do you mean? You believe in Allah? What? When you believe in Allah, you pray five times. You bend over yeah. five times. You fall. Yeah. Okay. And what Allah will give you as a reward? Paradise, what? heaven, what? No. Jannah. Okay, what what would happen in the paradise? Is it true that Allah promised you big boobs? Uh, everything. It says it says in the Quran that you will have anything you desire, anything. anything. You want a helicopter. So you what want if anything you, you want? So I asked a Muslim before about if you what? want to sleep with the man. He said anything. The God he says anything. So you can no, sleep no, with no, me. No 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 no. CP don't play the games with me. Don't play the games with CP. Yeah, hmm. it means anything that's right. It does not mean anything that's wrong. So anything right? right? It, it says that anything in the Quran. Right. Anything right. Ah. But you know, you know, Allah hates the. The you know the, that with the LGBT thing you know that this God of Abraham hates 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 that. So what what he's trying to say to you is if if you want anything, ask me. But mm. it has to be obviously good. Mm. So let me ask you: Did your God Allah promise you that a good did, thing? Did, so CP, did, I, did, I ask you to uh, accept Islam Did your Islam God, did, right your God now. Allah, did your God Allah promise you according to Muhammad? That in the heaven there is magazine of a Playboy magazine of men and women, and if you like an image, no, you get inside no, it with it. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, CP. What man. If, We're gonna have everything. What if I show? What? We're gonna have the who's there. Have okay, the wife. hold on, hold who's... on. Okay, uh, okay, hold on. If I show you the reference, what magazine. you would do? Magazine. What is it? Magazine is seen in the bloody. Yeah, it is. It At says mag on, it says CP, magazine. Yeah, it says magazine. Here we go. Let me put the hate for you and you will read it. Allah have a sex magazine and there's a market. There's a big bazaar, not only one magazine. There's billions. You Muslims, you go to you go to this uh, heaven and you enter and you choose any magazine, any picture of a man or a woman and you have sex with it. Do you see it? Are you there? Hello, are you there? Yeah, do you see it? The Messenger of Allah said, yeah, in yeah, paradise. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, read it, go ahead. Okay. Uh, Have, have you got a screen yeah i've got a screen yeah it's in the screen but we did not put for your pictures because we don't want you to be horny we are showing the hate without pictures of men if a man likes an image he would enter into it hmm. and if paradise day is getting all all who, who will why you why you jump why you jump it says an image of a man and women men and women does it say that in which nothing is brought is sold except images of men and women yeah okay if a man like an image who is going to like an image a man right yeah 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 okay you are a man aren't you 
Yeah, yeah. Okay, so now you go to heaven, you yeah, open yeah. the magazine, you find an image of uh, the tits of Mimi Hijab. You jump and have sex with Mimi Hijab. What do you think? It, if, if a man likes an image, he will enter into it. It will become his. And mm. he, he, there is a gathering of well, no creation. Let me see. Mm. He says that if you if you like an image, mm. and then it's going to be yours. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. What's, 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 what's wrong with that? What's, uh, it says in Arabic, that? you see, it says in Arabic, if it is a shtaha, shtaha is your sexual desire. If you have a desire for the image, you enter it. You mean image of what? Yeah, yeah. Image of men and women. That image will be yours. So you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So you will have sex no. with men and women. No, no, no. It does not say that. It says if, if, if you like, if you see an image, if you see an image, yeah, but you have to obviously that the man will choose uh, the woman and the woman will choose a man. Well, the it, customer is only men. You, the you customer is man. only men. Hold on. The customer is a man. It says if a man. Like an image, he will enter it. Does it say um, if a woman and a man like an image? No. It says if a man like the image. So the images is men and women images. But the customer is just a man. Nothing. So it's uh, images of men, of men and women. If the man hmm. likes image, he will enter. Yeah, but he says, he says. He's... Let us go back to zero. Do you think he Allah. He says, he says. Oh, hold on. I'm going to help you. Do you think Allah will choose his wife or partner from those images as we showed you in chapter 21 where he says if we choose to like to have a partner we will choose it from ourselves that's what he meant by ourselves those images yeah go on. Allah is going to have sex with those images no no not sure sex images this this hadith says yeah that there're going to be images that that the that the man is going to like he's going to choose the image that see he's going to be is be his what is that? Are you repeating yourself? I'm saying. I'm saying to you now. So there is images of men and women. There's magazines, tons of them, millions. There's the whole market, the whole bazaar, the whole mall. There's nothing but magazines, full of pictures yeah, of men and women. Do you think that Allah will choose one of those images to be His? No, 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 no. So we go no. back to zero. Would we have found it with ourselves? So Allah, He did not import partners from China. I bet you, by the way, those magazine is made in China. However, he said from ourself, as long Allah is one, and yet he say he will find a partner from ourself. The only way to understand this, that when the Muslim, they say uh, their God, Allah is one, he is like a one million, maybe. No, no, no. There is not just, there is not just Allah in heaven. There are the angels there, there are other creation that we that we, no, no, that no. we don't okay is the angels know. is the angels from Allah, from Allah are they Allah Allah's too? Uh, creations no it Allah's says here ourselves angels. it says ourselves ourselves the creation ourselves is, is yeah not, it could is, be him our cells you know if you know if I would talk with a group of people and, mm. and if and if I had about 15 people with us, and, 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 and I said ourselves. Okay, okay hold I on. So Allah, us, Allah, crea Allah created pigs, correct? Yeah. Is that included? No, no. Because you're talking about, uh, he's talking about ourselves, meaning up there in heaven. Ourselves meaning up there in heaven. Well, in heaven there the is... Angels, oh, Allah's yeah. there. No, they're not pigs in heaven. They're not pigs in heaven. Don't talk this rubbish. There's people. no pigs in heaven? There's no, there's no pigs in heaven. There's okay. What about donkeys? No, 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 no. The angels there. We have been. We, no, no, I'm we, asking, okay, hold we on. Have been what about that, what uh, about donkeys? Bro. No, 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 no. The angels. He's talking about. So, he's talking about. So you're a prophet. The, he did lie. So you're a prophet. He did lie when he said Allah. He sent him a donkey. It's called Al Burak. No, that was that was created. That was created. He created was where created. In, in heaven? He is in heaven, right? Nobody knows where that was created. If it, it was created on Earth or it was okay, created hold on. Earth. What do you mean? We, there's no nobody knows. We know it's in China, but this is another question now. You don't know where did it's Allah, created. Did Allah send His donkey from the heaven down to Earth, and His name is Al Burak? Yes or no? He created the Burak. Yes. Hmm. Let me ask you. Let's make it simple. So now we have confirmed that there's donkey. So it's possible that Allah will have sex with the donkeys. What about dogs? No, no. 
What about dogs? No, 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 no. Are you no. denying that Allah he have a dog? No, he are not. He can he can create what or whatever he wills. But the main things are him and the angels. This is not the question. If we go to the chapter of An Najm, if we go to the chapter of An Najm and we read yeah. the interpretation, it says that Allah he have a dog. Do you agree? Yes, a dog. Where? Where? What's wrong with you? Where? Each time I say something to you, you say where, where, and never, where? and I don't know what you will say next. I never heard no, this before. No, you, you are saying to me that he has a, he has a dog. Yeah, I'm asking you, where is this? Where In is the, this? I just told you, chapter of Najm. Read the chapter interpretation. It says that when the Najm fell down, when Najmu Ida Hawa, chapter fifty-three, verse number one. The cousin of Muhammad yes. said to him, I don't want to worship the God of the stars. Who is the God of the stars? Do you know who is the God of the stars? No. Allah? How how Allah is the God of the stars? Are you Sabia? Is that is that the, what they want the moon god, maybe? No, no, no. Okay, Allah swear by the star when the star go down. Why yes. Allah swear by the star? Out of, out, of, out, of, out of respect for the for his for creation, does Allah he respect Allah respect his creation? Do Allah respect dogs and yeah. pigs? He respects uh, dogs, pigs, huh. pigs. They talk about pigs there, yeah, the swine. Yeah, Jesus killed the pigs, many of them. No, he did not kill them. Oh no! According to the New Testament, he killed pigs. Uh, hold on, on. Abdul, hold on. Abdul, well. Abdul, 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 okay, you yeah. just say Jesus, right? I want to ask you, yeah, so why Allah did not kill pigs? Eh? Why Allah, hmm? why Allah did not kill pigs? What do you mean? You what just said everybody, you everybody heard you saying a second ago, Jesus killed pigs, right? Yes, yes, why, why Allah did not, why Allah cannot kill pigs? He can do, he can do if he wants. Uh, if he wants, all he can do. everything Allah about it is the, if he wants. In the okay. hadith, okay. in the hadith, okay. no, no, you never let me answer. Uh, of course, CP man, you have to be fair here. Mm, mm. In the in the hadith, it says Jesus is is, is gonna come. He's gonna take the cross and kill the swine, kill the pig. So so he's been ordered by Allah to kill the swine and to take the cross. Yeah, I watched but that. that I, I, I did watch John Wick movie. But isn't it no, funny? No, 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 isn't it, isn't it funny? Isn't it isn't it funny that you have a God? You have a God. He will yeah. send Jesus. Jesus yeah. now are waiting for all those thousand of years just to come and kill a pig. No, he's not going to come and kill a pig. He's 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 going to come and kill the Antichrist. Okay, the I, will, I will go with you. Why Muhammad cannot kill the pig and he cannot kill the Antichrist? What do you mean? Because the Antichrist, because the because the because the what do you call it? The the Jews. Re said no to Jesus, and they are waiting for the Antichrist. The Jews today mm. are waiting for the Antichrist, and mm. that's why, uh, that's why Allah is going to send Jesus to kill this Antichrist. The whole, As I know that the Messiah. Jews are waiting for the, the Messiah, that's, not waiting for the they, Antichrist. Yeah, no, no, no. They think, they think is going to be the Antichrist. We believe in the Hadith that they are waiting for this Messiah, the false one. Mm. This is why they're going to have a big army. Okay, okay. Let's, let's go back to zero. Let's go back to zero. So. On. The only one who can kill the evil is pigs are evil. No, no, they're not evil, but so, they're not. Clean. So, what's the problem with them? Eh? What's the problem with the pigs? The problem is, God says in the Old Testament, you cannot eat them, they are unclean. Okay, God in the Old Testament says you cannot eat camels. Why you Muslims eat camels? What's that? What's that? No, God in the Old Testament says camels are unclean. Why you Muslims eat camels? No, 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 no. Secondly, God, secondly, who God, said to you that you as a Muslim you cannot eat pigs? You eat pigs. You eat pigs. Are you eat pigs? You eat Muslims, pigs. you Muslims, you eat pigs. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question here? These ex-Muslims, they can never eat pig. You know why? They're scared of Allah. They never eat pig. Okay. You will, you will never. Let, let, let me let me make it simple. But you're scared. So if a Christians are cooking a pig, you Muslims can eat it or not? Hello. If a Christian's pig. cooking a pig, what's that? He cut it off. Can you eat it or yeah. not? If a Christian eat, uh, cooks pig, and uh, no, no, ne no, never. This is why we're saying. Okay, this this is why this is why we say 
uh, the Quran is written by a stupid guy. Here we go. The why, verse, why, 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 why? Well, the Quran says you can eat our food no matter what it is. Here we go. No, 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 no. Don't be, don't be trying to be clever there. It says you can eat from the people of the book, mm -hmm. but that does not mean you can eat the swine. The, the Jews do not eat the swine. Okay. It's only the Christians who 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 have been fooled. That's wonderful. You, you okay, the... only the Christians, but oh. it says they are the people of the book, which means the Jews and the Christians. It's lawful for you to eat their food. We, so the Christian, we they eat, eat pigs. You eat pigs. No, what what he's trying to say is whatever they cook, anything any that's halal, they eat it. Yeah, yeah whatever they pig. cook, whatever cook. Oh, look, no, let us go. Let us make it simple. Okay, if, are you allowed if you are hungry to eat pigs? Only if you are gonna uh, die. If if you are gonna die. So why why if you are going to die you can eat pigs? Because because Allah is a most merciful. He said it. He said it. You can only eat it if you're gonna die to stay. Okay, your I will I will life. go with you. Can the Jews? You have to go. Can the Jews? Yeah. Uh, 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 do fishing in Saturday? The Jews. I don't care about the Jews. They are big. They are not nothing. Is the Jews? Is the Jews? The Muslim Jews? The Muslim Jews? According to your Quran, there's Muslim the Jews. Muslim Jews? There's no such thing as Muslim Jews. Uh, the one who followed no Moses. Jews. The one who followed no, Moses. No, no, Don't you no, Muslims no, say that not. Moses was a was a was a Muslim? Yeah, he okay. was Muslim. All right. So, isn't it the Quran says that Allah is the one who sent the Torah? Yes. Okay. So the Jews who the Quran yeah. speak about them, who did fishing in Saturday. Yeah. Is it true yeah. that because they did fishing on Saturday, Allah He made them pigs and monkeys? Yes, yeah, that is true. That okay. Is true. How many Muslims today they are eating pork? How many Muslims not eat pork? Hmm. I don't. I, some. Have you ever seen one of them? Rest. Have you ever seen one of them? Allah made him a pig and a monkey for eating pork. I have never seen. I have never seen in my life any Muslim eat pork. Well, I have. I seen. A, I seen thousands of Muslims eating pork. They're, they're hypocrites. They're the hypocrites. And they so okay, pork. no problem. So why Allah did not make them pigs and monkeys? Here we go. They broke His command. No, 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 no. This is. This Which is, one is, is more horrible to do fishing in Saturday or to eat pork in Islam? In Islam. No, but the Jews are. This was a big thing. Let me ask you. Sabbath, can you? Can Sabbath you do? Was a big can thing. you do fishing in Saturday as a Muslim? Yes. How the old, how the old, so why why the, the Jews cannot do fishing on Saturday if you have the same God? No, no. But that was only for them. That was only for that them groups of children of Israel at that time. It was okay. not for, it so, was not for now. So, but based on the Quran, if you break the command of Allah, Allah will make you a pig and a monkey, correct? No, no. That was only to the Jews. The punishment was only okay, for the Jews. Okay, I will go with that you. How many Jews you. today, how many Jews today they do fishing on Saturday? I don't know. So why Allah is not making them pigs and monkeys? Because you know why? Mm. You know why? Why? Because, why? Why? Because, Tell me why. I cannot well, wait. Let me answer. Uh huh. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Because because yeah because there's a new law there's a new law and a new Quran that's come for guidance. Do what? Public. What? What? The the you know the law of Moses is being finished. Finished. Halas. Now Quran come is given new. But the Jews are still uh, Jews. The Jews are like, still Jews. Okay. No, can you name no, for me one Jew no, in the time of Muhammad before the Quran is is he came? One Jew in the time of Muhammad he became a pig for doing such a thing, working in Saturday. At the, at, the, at the time, no, 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 no. That was at the time of Moses only. That was the time. Eh, 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 uh, uh, it only happened at the time of okay. Moses. Okay, is it, it fair? If is it fair that if the Jews they break the Sabbath, Allah will make them pigs and monkeys. But if a Muslim break Islam uh, order of Allah, Allah will not make them pigs and monkeys. Is that a logical thing for you? No, he can punish. Or he can punish whichever group he. Will. Okay, Allah, Allah, he, example, Allah, he threatened the Christians. He will erase their faces if you don't believe in Muhammad in the time of Muhammad. Did Allah erase yeah. their faces? What, what do you mean? What do you mean? He will do. No, he, will he, did do. Not, he did not say he will. He said not in the in the judgment day. He says now, if you don't believe right now, the Christian and the Jews, if you don't believe in Muhammad, yeah. I will raise your faces. Yeah, I will, I will, I will, I will raise faces when 
Well, now. When? Now. No, 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 no. Okay, read carefully. Read, read carefully. Uh, Abdul, read carefully. It says, as we did to the people of who broke the Sabbath. Yeah. Okay. The people who did the Sabbath broke the Sabbath. Allah, right away, He yeah. made them pigs and monkeys the same day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, Allah, your God, He made us a threat to the Christian and the Jews. If you don't believe in Muhammad, yeah. Allah will erase your faces and He will make your face backward and He will erase your eyebrows, your mouth, your nose will be in the back and be funny. Did that happen? Yeah. No, no, no. He, Allah is giving you an example that as He punished the Jews, He's going to punish you lot as well. Okay, he, but he punished he, the Jews. He did not say, he, but okay, he gave an example. You are right. He gave an example, but the example about something he did right away when they broke his order. But Allah, he did not say. He, the, the, but he did not say he will do it right away. No, he Christians. said. No, he said. He no, said the no, same no, no, as no, no, we no. did. He said the same as we did to those who broke the Sabbath. Yeah. So that's mean. That's not will be in the judgment day. That will be no, immediately. No, how do you know? No, 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 no. It does not say. It does not say. It doesn't happen right away. It's warning you lot. Did he say? Okay. Did he say? Did he say? You see, he did not say before you die. Believe before you die. He says, believe. Otherwise, we'll erase your face. So the erasing the face will happen before they die. No, he sent you. Hmm. He sent what? Before you die, believe, or else on the day of judgment, he said, leave. Now or else the day of judgment. What is the word? What is the word? What is the word in the what is the word in the day of judgment? Are you adding Quran now? Well, you he's giving a warning. If if you if you see if you read the whole Quran, he's warning. Yeah, but already he compared them. Already he compared them. You said to me he gave an example, right? He gave example like okay. the Jews. So the example. Okay, okay. Did Allah did Allah made the pigs and the monkeys out of the Jews in the judgment day? Yeah. Already or already happened? No. It already happened. Okay, that's mean. If that will happen, it's going to be the same because he is the one who chose the example, not you. He chose the no, Jews. He, he did no. not say. He did not say in the judgment day. He said the same as I did to the Jews. The same as I did to the Jews. Yeah. No. He he's saying the same as he did to the Jews. You are the only Muslim when you answer me. You say yeah and no in the same time. You are like Allah mentally ill. Listen no, but carefully. he's saying he said to you. He said to you that. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, I will go with you. You have to go with me. If, you have to accept Islam. <laughs> okay, I have to accept Islam. Exactly. I mean, this is a story. It's true. It's true story. This is true story. True story. CP. So, so Abdul, Abdul. If a Muslim he rape a child like Muhammad, which one is more? Oh, here we go it, again. It, 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 which which more is more uh, uh, like ugly, to break the Sabbath or to rape a child in Islam? What's that? The both wrong. So why Allah never both made that somebody he rape a child, a pig or a monkey? Because he gave this law of Sabbath, it was a big thing. It was a big thing at the time of Moses. It's a big so it, law. So it was a big, a big thing, and it's and okay, so, and, no. and now it's not big, right? Eh? Eh. Now the now okay. the let me ask Sabbath you: When Allah He made when Allah He made the Jews pigs and monkeys, do those Jews yeah. still following the law of Moses? Stop them Jews, yeah. But they're but they but they but they're not supposed to be. They're not supposed to be now. They're they not following what? the Quran. They what? are following the Quran now. They're not following the Torah. The Torah is finished now. The monkeys are following. Okay, you are saying the monkeys now they are following the Quran. They should be. They should do. They should do. I'm saying they should do. Okay, did Allah give the monkeys Quran? No, the Allah giving told them that the Quran you have to follow the Quran Allah told who now the, the monkeys the Jews and Christians the Jews and Christians I'm talking today. about the monkeys I'm talking about the monkeys the monkeys did Allah give them Quran so the monkeys are finished huh? the monkeys finished the, the, the monkeys are finished killed off they old that was about three thousand years ago okay how many how many, how, how many thousand years how many about time of uh, Musa so, that must have been so none of those monkeys are exist in the time of Muhammad, right? At that time, yeah, I, I doubt uh, that was 14 years ago. I doubt it. I yeah. Doubt it. I don't know. Okay, so uh, is the monkeys Muslims? No, no. Okay, so why the hadith says that the monkeys they follow the Islamic law, Sharia law? What do you mean? There's a story of a, a female monkey. She cheated her yeah. husband, Mr. Shapanzi. And the Muslim monkeys, they gather and they stone her to death. Where is this? The hate in front of you, Sahih al-Bukhari. Uh, we believe in, uh, in, uh, 
in uh, Islam, all animals submit. A second ago, I asked you. Is, uh, a second ago, I asked you. A second, I asked you. Do the monkeys follow the Quran and for Islam? You said adopt it. I don't know. No, no, they don't follow the Quran. Okay. They don't follow so the, the monkeys. Seen, so okay. So now you are confirming that monkeys are Muslims. No, I'm not saying them Muslims. I'm saying that they that they believe in God. They believe that they. This is not the question. Allah. This is not the question. Here we go. The story in yeah. front of me says that they follow the Sharia law. Sharia law. Sharia law. Sharia law. Come on, CP man. You're talking rubbish here, man. Are you insulting your religion now? Here. here we go. This, this is your prophet speaking. Oh. This is your prophet. Story is coming from a Sahabi of your prophet. A companion. Come on. Well, read for us. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. During the pre-Islamic period mm. of ignorance, I was I saw she monkeys on by number of monkeys. They were all stoning it because they had committed. They were all stoning it because oh. Mm. Yeah, that that means that means that it could be uh, true. That means. Okay, so the, those are Muslim monkeys, correct? The yeah. Okay, but yeah, monkeys, yeah, yeah, but yeah. monkeys, they drink, but monkeys, they drink their, they drink their piss. What do you mean? Yeah. What do you mean? Because the animals are monkeys. They, they animals. drink. Okay, so how the they animals. are? How they are Muslims and they drink their piss? So for so for so for example, if uh, I if I Think about my own case, yeah. Mm. I am I. I can still be a, uh, a Muslim. I can still be a Muslim. Ah, okay. Doing so, did your prophet drink his piss? No, 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 no. Well, Don't the hadith stupid. says the hadith says that the Muslim they drunk the piss of your prophet. <laughs> Where's that? Well, is it, that isn't, it a, isn't it a woman? She drunk the piss of your prophet, and then the prophet he told her. The fire will not touch your stomach. Show me the, show me the hadith about please. Here we go. That that that, that companions uh, drunk. Uh, uh, we answer. Uh, uh, we answer Abdul until we find the hadiths. A Muslim Abdul saying, read for us Corinthians fourteen about women. They have to stay silent in the church. Those are women who they are talking about <laughs> none sense, which means. They are not praying to God and they are not worshiping. They are talking about, did you wash your dishes? Did you see? Those women are not allowed to talk. Otherwise, the Bible says that there is, we have, a, we have a book actually speaking about women who they are prophets. Come on, you don't talk about so, Abdul, women Abdul, rights. Abdul, Abdul, I'm answering the guy in the chat. Women rights in the Bible. Come Abdul, on. Abdul, Abdul, Abdul. Okay. So, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, we so here. we have a prophets and we have judges in the Bible. They are women. So that will silence you. In the same time, your prophet is the one who says the majority of Muslim women they are going to go to hellfire. Now here, let us go to hadith. Abdul, listen. This is the hadith. Let me, why? Show, you, let me show you the hadith about your prophet. Why is that? About Muslims drinking the piss of your prophet. Okay, okay, go. On. All right. Let us see. Go on, go on, go on. Go on. Around, around. Uh, let us see. The, the main argument is, yeah, the only way on. a person cannot be a Muslim if he commits, if he, if he, if he commits kufr. That's the only way he can leave mm. Islam. There's no other way. Mm. What is what does kufr mean? You know that as well. Keep what, in it. what does kufr mean? Yeah. What is kufr? I'm saying, I'm saying the only. Oh yeah, let, let me let me let me answer. The only way a person can leave Islam is if he commits kufr. Meaning, uh, shirk. If he if he associate partners with Allah, that's the only way. Hmm. Do Allah partner with Allah? Eh? Do Allah partner with Allah? No, no. Allah okay, is so one how, holy. So how before. Allah? So how <laughs> Allah associate the name of Muhammad with His name? Eh? What, hmm. what do you mean? How Allah associate? Partner with Allah by associating the name of Muhammad with his name. 
He does not associate Muhammad with his name at all. He does. Isn't it you Muslim you say that Allah he wrote the name of Muhammad on his on his chair? That is not true. That's not true. That's I not can true. show you the reference. And here this is the that story. Is not true. Where the heck you got that from? This is the story of, of your Muslim female. She is a maid of your prophet. She drank the piss of your prophet. And your prophet he said to her that there is no your you, you, you know yeah, your stomach will not touch fire because she drank the piss of your prophet. What do you say? Drink urine. Hmm. Wait, the wait. Let me read it. Let me hold on. Hmm. Here we go. Um. CP by drinking urine does not make you leave Islam. What make you leave Islam or ship in other person, right? That Christians have, have uh, Christians. Okay, did your prophet? Okay, let us go there then. Did Jesus, you did your did your prophet receive satanic verses and he worship other gods beside Allah? The three daughters specifically of Allah. No, no, he never worship anyone else. The Quran says that, okay, we can go and read the interpretation. We will see that Allah, he takes satanic verses which shaitan he put in his mouth and he was worshipping the three daughters of Allah. So your prophet, he left us now, correct? No, no, no. He did not worship anyone else. He didn't worship the anyone story else. says, Muhammad, he says, in al-gharani qal'ula shafa'atahunna la turtaja. The three daughters of Allah, the sharani, the goddess, they are the intercession is a must, and I can show you the reference right now. Are you willing to read? Oh, are you willing to read? Are, you, hadith there. are you walking or what? Uh, what's happening with you? Yeah, yeah, no, no, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Okay, chapter 22, verse number 52. What interpretation do you like me to read for you? Any, any is that the name of a scholar? Um, New scholar. Yusuf Ali did. Yusuf Ali is a scholar now? Yusuf Ali. Hmm. There's a new scholar. Yusuf Ali is a scholar. No, no, it's not my school. You see. Yusuf Ali is the easiest one. The easiest one you can do. Yeah, easy teasy, yeah. Run. Easy. No, it's not like you're bloody. Do he King show James his version. Do he show his King James version is the most corrupted, corrupted Bible in the world. Uh, okay, here we go. It says. That the Prophet, when he was reciting the chapter of a Najm, <clears throat> and then uh, Allah, the Shaitan, he cast uh, in his uh, in his mouth. Aren't you? Have you considered Allah and Al-Uzza, the Mana, the third? As a result, Shaitan cast in well, him into his tongue, without his Prophet, the Prophet being aware of the following words: Those are the high flying crans of Al Gharaniq, their intercession is to be hoped for. You're a prophet, you worship the three daughters of Allah. And you are the one who said that you leave Islam only if you associate somebody with Allah, correct? Yeah. So Muhammad left Islam at that moment, at least. Commanded to live a message, a prophet, Nabi, who has been commanded to live anything. The Prophet had joining assembly of the men's of and third one and added as a result without is without is the prophets being aware. Mm -hmm. So your prophet was not aware. He received satanic verses and he worshipped the three rows of Allah. Was he a prophet now or satanic prophet? No oh, no. What is this supposed to be? Is this supposed to be a hadith or, or, or this is in the Quran. Quran says Allah will take the verses which Shaitan he threw in the mouth of Muhammad. And this is Tafsir al Jalalain. Result out of his tongue without. Those are the high flank. Your prophet is satanic prophet. He receives satanic As a result of Satan to his tongue without his prophet being aware of it. Mm.
So now your prophet, he will not have endless penis as Allah he promised. No, no, no. He will have shorter penis than yours. Because look, no, you did not Ali. worship. Did you worship the three rods of Allah yourself? Did you worship the three Ali, daughters Ali, of Allah? Is did you worship the three no, 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 no. Okay. These so three, you, so let us compare no, now. These, let us compare. Let's no. compare between you and Muhammad. Muhammad he worshipped the three daughters of Allah. You did not worship the three daughters of Allah. No, he didn't. He didn't worship them. It he says did not worship there, them. It, it says. Did, did it them. says. It says that he, he said. No, not only that. He bowed down and they bowed down too. He bowed down. Yeah. He bowed down and they bowed down too. Everybody is bowing down to who? To the three daughters of Allah. You're a prophet, literally. But by saying actually their intercession, he just agreed that they are goddess and he named them as goddess. So you're a prophet, he worshiped them, and that will make his penis shorter than yours because the, the, remember, Allah will make a penis of a Muslim longer depending on how good he is. So you are a good Muslim, Allah will make your penis very long. It says here, and then he prostrated, and all the Muslims follow, and the pagans they follow too. Everybody prostrate to the devil. No, it is wait, 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 wait. Being aware of the following high cranes. Sniff, yeah, sniff. Too much drugs. No, it's it's a it's a, it's a winter year. Yeah. Did you say winter? Yeah, it's winter. Uh your God he thinks there is two uh there's two sons and there's two east. What do you think about that? But anyway, let's finish this one first. All the most followed Su and prostrate who were present prostrate to all those present. Carried. Hmm. So you're a prophet. Yeah, he but prostrate. he might made a mistake. He might made a mistake. Okay, well, uh, take take care. He made, guys, he made a mistake by worshipping three, three other gods. He made a mistake. It's a mistake. <laughs> Let us take another Muslim. Enough with this Abdul. He's just an idiot. Text me if you like me to call you. As you see, those Muslims are just a bunch of monk. I mean, they, you know, they fly from place to a place. Why you are calling me back? Each time I, I show you something, you you know, you give me a funny answer. Did you say your prophet yeah. made a mistake? No, no, no. I, that that verse here, yeah, I need, I need, I need to go through it properly and see what is. Okay, so what why you are calling back? Did you did you get the answer or not? Because I I ask you a thousand questions, you have no answer for anything. What do you mean you have no question? I answer I answer all I answer you all. You answer nothing. Okay, let's go back. Let's go. Let us go back. Let us go back. Okay. Are you going to have images? You have sex with them? Yes or no? Images. You forgot? No. It says it says about images. It talks about images. If if uh, you like it. Mm -hmm. Image mm -hmm. and then I'll see if you can have it. I Just go, man. Don't don't call me now. I want to take a break from you. Uh, the idiot who is posting, read for us, Luke. You just prove that Jesus is God. You Muslim, you say, where Jesus says I am God, worship me. Don't call me Abdul. Don't for force me to block you, Hussein. Enough of your stupidity for now. I'll take a break from your stupidity. They say, they say to you, look at this idiot. Why you are you calling me? Do you have answers? Hello. Do you have answers? Off for some reason. Do you have answers? You keep cutting off. Okay. So why your prophet, he worshipped the three daughters of Allah and he prostrate for them? Go ahead. I don't, I, I don't know. I need, I need to go to that verse. So you're a prophet. You are the one who said to me, Allah forgive not those who associate with him, correct? Yeah. Okay. Is Allah going to forgive Muhammad for associating with him? No, but it, it just it depends. And if, if what if depends? I want an answer. Does the Quran says Allah forgive not those who associate with Him? Yes or no? It does say that. Okay. Does say that. But, did your but, prophet? But did your prophet in the story commit shirk? Did your prophet commit shirk? It just say that. It just say that Satan. 
Same doesn't matter. Did, doesn't matter. I can say I can say the same excuse because always at the end of the day, you must believe that Shaitan is the one who whisper for you, right? So Shaitan, he told him. So no, why no, Muhammad no. he obey Shaitan? What's this? Uh, I don't hear you. I don't hear you. Say again. You don't know what verse number we're talking what's about. This, chapter, what's this, bro, this, uh, chapter twenty-two, verse number fifty-two. Hmm. I'll send you before you anyone a prophet except when he spoke. When he spoke, mm. but Allah, but, but Allah abolished that which Satan throws in. Mm. But he says, he says after that, but but Allah abolishes. It takes away what Satan was whispering. Who care? How we know first that so is that means, How we know that first? Means, that means mm. that means what? That means that that means that the, that means that the devil was. Whispering crap in, in into the ears of the prophets, mm. but Allah made sure that okay, Allah, the, the, will the not devil succeed. he was whispering to the prophet, but the prophet he made satanic verses, he said them and he bowed down. Is Allah going to take off the bow down too? And when you say that Allah will take off from the Quran the satanic verses, did you say that? No, it says that what whatever whatever was going on, whatever the the, the devil was whispering, yeah. God made sure what that whispering. That. It says it threw in his mouth. Yeah, but did, by okay, did by Muhammad how, by did Muhammad whispering. recite what Shaitan he told him? Did he recite it? No, 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 no. He would. The don't devil waste was my time, man. Don't, to... don't waste my time. Don't go. Yeah, just okay. don't call me again. I will block you. Take a break. What an idiot. It says that Shaitan he throw in his mouth and then he prostrate and he said that this the the uh, 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 the three doors of Allah their intercession is a must and he said no 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 no. It says in the front of you that Allah will take away what Shaitan he throw, take it from where from the Quran. So the Quran, based in the Quran, Quran was corrupted, and now as long Shaitan was able to throw once. Who is going to stop the shaitan from throwing again? How we can know that this verse itself is not made by the shaitan himself? So people will relax. If Muhammad was under the influence of shaitan, and shaitan was able to make him bow down, a recite satanic verses. Let us see another Muslim. Ultimate fart. Hello. Yeah, run, dummy, run. <laughs> How I know it's you? Do you know? <laughs> Potatoes. How I know it's you? <laughs> run. <laughs> this guy, he don't even have enough. That's it, that's it, Zafar. That's it, Hussein. Idiot. So, what confirm is that Muslims, they have no answer for anything. Islam is written, Islam as a religion, is not a religion, it's a stupid cult, you know. Uh, Muhammad trying to cover his ass wherever he go. When he was with the pagan, he worshipped the gods of the pagans. Just to make them follow him. When the news is spread, this is what Muslim books, by the way, say, it's not me. When the news spread that Muhammad he accepted and he worshipped the three doors of Allah, many Muslims left Islam. <laughs> this is in their books. 
And then Muhammad, because he want to clean himself from the stupidity, he says, oh, shaitan, he throw it in my mouth. Hello? Hello? Yes, my friend. Are you a Muslim? No, I'm a Christian, but I'd like to see like a lot of your videos. All right, my friend. Thank you for calling. Please don't call me if you are a Christian. We want only Abdul. This is Abdul season. All right. Hello. Hello. Ah, here we go, another idiot. This guy is speaking from his ass. If you are a kid, don't call because that will be embarrassment to your religion. So as you see, this is a religion is written and made by a mental ill person. If you believe in me, Allah will make your penis endless. Isn't it? This is a promise of a mentally ill person. If you believe in me, I will give you big boobs. If you believe in me, I will give you a sex magazine. You look at the images, any image you like, you join. If you believe in me, I will give you slaves in heaven. Even in heaven, there's slaves. The lowest reward of a Muslim in heaven, the lowest is 72 women and 80,000 little boys are slaves. That promise alone make you sick, proving to you that the one who wrote this is mentally ill. Because heaven should not have slaves, abuse, neither of men or children or women. We are running away from slavery. We are running away from unjust. So we go to heaven now, and now in heaven, we will be owners of tens of thousands of slaves. And those slaves are little boys. What kind of religion this religion is? And what the purpose of it? There is no question Islam is written by a mentally ill person. All what he try is to tempt your penis. It's a penis cult. When Muhammad, he promised the Muslims, you will be more rich than 10 kings. Isn't it this is the mental illness promise? Because what rich will be meaning in heaven if everything for free? When Muhammad, he promised you gold and silver in the heaven, Imagine there's a God, he promised us to wear a bracelet from gold and to have a cushion and to have bed. Bed. We will have what? Bed. And you will be wearing a bracelet from gold in different hadith he says or the verse from silver because he forgot what he promised isn't it proof that this is written by an idiot let us see we have a Muslim maybe this is ultimate fault he's obsessed I think this is ultimate fault. Guys, shall we take ultimate fault for a snack? What do you think? What do you think? Now the Muslim, he posed for us Luke 19, that Jesus says, and this enemy of mine, bring them here and slay them, 
Well, this is a proof that Jesus is God. Isn't you Muslims believe that God is going to send Jesus in the judgment day, you idiot? And even he will slay the Dajjal? Potatoes. That is Jesus. Your God can do nothing. Your God is a potato. Your God, he needed to do jihad so he can have victory. Without you, he's a potato. Yeah, I think this is maybe ultimate fort. But let us, let us take ultimate fort for a snack. Uh, give me a break. His internet is not even working. Do we have any Abdul? Anyone? Have you ever heard of a God? He promised us such a promise that you will wear a t-shirt made in Iran by Al Khomeini. In the time of Muhammad, there was kind of fabric, it's called istabrak, like Gucci. And this is something only rich people can buy. Muhammad, he promised us Gucci. Is that really a promise of God? He used a name of a brand. So if Muhammad was exist today, he will promise you shoes of Nike. This is God making promise. Everything in this cult is based in mental illness. Endless penis. The women vagina will fit for that. How explain to me? If the penis is endless and the women vagina fit for that, is that a long endless tunnel? Mentally ill Muhammad. None of this makes sense and none of this even makes sense to monkeys. Have you ever heard of a God? He says to you, we will be reclining in the cushions. The translation, by the way, here took the word cushion off. I don't know why. Let us change the translator so the word cushion will appear. Because when you change the translator, the, tra the Quran trans changed. The whole Quran changed. Isn't that amazing? Just change the translator. Hmm. Here there's no question too. What happened to the question? It's done, it's gone. Let's change the translator again. <laughs> Until we find the cushions. Maybe the question is coming soon. Hmm. Recline in raised couches. Where is the question? They are translating that uh, there's no cushion here. But anyway, this is God. He promised me a couch and a brace from gold. And why a man want to wear a brace from gold? What that will do to him exactly? You feel better? And every man he will have two heaven. Like what he will do to heaven, one is not enough. One is made from gold and one is made from silver. Is that really beautiful? Is it beautiful to have a heaven made of gold? Let us show you the hadith. Hmm. Read with me and laugh. This is religion. The Prophet said there will be two paradise of silver 
and all the dishes inside made of silver and two paradise made of gold and all the dishes inside made of gold <laughs> I am telling you, this is the most ugly paradise ever. What is the value of paradise of gold? Gold is valuable there for who? In the stock market? And is that going to be nice to have everything around you made from gold? Isn't it the most boring, stupid, ugly? Let us see this, Abdul. Call the Abdul. We tried to call their internet not working. <clears throat> None of them is internet is working. Okay, take a hike. Do we have any Muslim? Somebody saying Luke nineteen twenty seven wasn't Jesus saying that it was narration. Uh, that's that, I like the word narration. Hmm. No, my friend, Jesus will be saying that. Jesus, when he come, with the glory of his angels, he will order his angels to bring those who did not believe in him. Do we have any Abdul? I like it when somebody using a Christian name, using narration. We don't have something called narration. When we say that Jesus said, this is not narration. He said. Do we have any Abdul? Who is an Abdul would like to have an endless penis and heaven made of gold? Two heaven of gold and two heaven of silvers. All the dishes inside is made of gold and silver. Hello? So Allah may, you said Allah say maybe, you lying? Uh, Allah did not say maybe? No, he never said maybe. Okay, what, what verse we are talking about, Abdul? Any verse, I, I heard he's quoting a verse, whatever verse you're quoting, oh, okay. don't show it, but, and stop uh, lying. I'm going to expose your ass Any again. verse, any verse? You shit your pants again. Okay, use, don't use bad language if you want to speak like an adult, okay? Bad language, you, you, you're saying anything. Okay, you okay read say. the verse, here we go, chapter 48, yeah. verse number 2. Read, read it, read it. You read it. You read it, stupid. Chapter 48, verse number 2. Go ahead. Okay, let me get my other thing. <laughs> the other things. Of his angels. Is it on the screen? Yeah. His not yet. Hmm. Not yet. Read it. It's not here yet. Do we have any I see a hadith uh, talking about narrated uh, Abdul whatever. Hmm. Using narration, we don't have something. 
What was he talking about? Jesus, say this is not. Oh, don't waste my time. Read it or not. Can't you open from your side your Quran? Do you need even to mm -hmm. see it in the screen? Okay, let's see. It said, uh, do so that Allah may is not maybe. You don't understand English. Uh, so maybe is different from maybe. No, if you just saw that. Okay, what may what may you, forgive you? What may forgive you mean? Is that maybe? May forgive you means that so may. I lost you. Abdullah. May I means. Yeah, listen, let uh, me teach you again. I, uh, I, I'm your daddy. Remember. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, so that Allah may is uh, not maybe. So that Allah may is, means that so that Allah can forgive you. Uh, may and can as be used as. So Allah can justify why am I going to be forgiving you? Mm. If you do this, so that I may, so that Allah may, it's mm. not maybe Allah will. Mm. You understand? Mm. It's not maybe. You so, don't. So in English, when we say may, we do not mean you maybe. Understand English? Is That's it? the thing about it. Yeah. So you said so you said. So okay, hold on, hold on. So when Allah He say, he, may Allah forgive you. you. That, okay. Oh, you understand Abdul, first. Eh, just a stupid son of Muda. Don't waste my time. If God is talking, He don't say may. That is somebody else asking God, praying to God that may God forgive you. It's a wish. You're a stupid donkey. You do not even know how to read your Quran. So show me where it says maybe. The whole Quran is full of maybes. Here we go. I'm not going to waste my time with you because you will scream and you will argue. You are just an arrogant donkey. Literally. Let me show you how many maybes. All those verses are maybes. Look how many, look how many, look, 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 look. <laughs> all of this, all of this is maybes. All of this is maybes. Maybes, 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 not even may, maybe. <laughs> the God of maybe. <laughs> The God of maybe. Show me where it says in the Quran maybe. You see, you see why I don't talk to you. You are just a little stupid kid. You are a, you are a donkey. All those are saying maybe. 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 <laughs> And you, you know, the Muslim translation is even make it more, more funnier. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> well, show me a word maybe. So supposedly may is different from maybe. Ultimate fault is the genius. It says in the translation, may. It does not say maybe. You need to show me maybe. Okay, here we go, maybe. Don't call me your donkey. You're just a little tiny idiot. Show me the maybe. Oh, this is may. This is not maybe. Where is the maybe? You don't speak English? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, this is maybe. <laughs> Are you happy now? <laughs> This guy, I mean, it doesn't take me even two seconds to beat you. Here we go. This is the maybe. But I have no patience no more with this. With the, this guy is the most stupid, arrogant. He don't know Arabic. He don't accept Muslim translation. He don't accept tafsir interpretation. And he have he said any tafsir is rejected. Why? Because it's made by a human. And then he give you his own tafsir. Look like he is not a human. <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps it's not maybe, huh? <laughs> what kind of God he says? Maybe if we were to divorce you, his Lord will grant him exchange. And since when, you see here the Arab, they used to do exchange women, which means you don't like your wife, you are bored with her. You take mine, I take yours. How filthy this cult is.
And this is what he did with his own son. He took the wife of his own son. They used to do exchange. And here you ask yourself, what kind of God he teaches us a teaching, and what kind of God he say maybe? You see, did Jesus say to the one, your sin is forgiven? Did he say to him, maybe your sin is forgiven? No, he said, go and your sin is forgiven. He said to the Jews, which one is easier? To say to him, go and your sin is forgiven, or to say to him, go and carry your bed and walk? This is why we say the Quran is written by a stupid, mentally ill person, because if the one is talking is God, he will not say me before he is going to be sure. Another idiot, just to show you how Muslim try to supposedly refute us. Where is that text? Just to show you how desperate they are. Christian Prince, do you know that the Christian colonized the earth? Abdul, Egypt is not the Arab or the land of the Arab. Did you colonize it? You took it from their own people, and until now, the Christians who own the land, the Coptic, the real Egyptian, they are not owning it. What about Syria? What about Iraq? What about Jordan? What about Israel? What about uh, Morocco? What about Tunisia? What about Algeria? What about uh, uh, the, the, the land of Turkey? This is not Turkey. There's not nothing is called Turkey. This is the land of the Christians. What and you went all the way to the China, and you are talking about colonize? Secondly, you idiot. We are talking about God. So you could not answer it. So now you want to change the topic to talk about Trump. <laughs> Stupid people. Your God is your God is the rapist. Your God is the criminal. Your God is the one who ordered Muhammad are being ordered to kill all mankind, all mankind, until they convert to Islam. Idiot. They always love to play victims. Always. They kill you and they go in your funeral. Always. Maybe. Show me where it says. And you know what? Just to let you know that when when the European they came to the Middle East, they built hospitals and schools. Look what they did in Afghanistan. The American there for 20 years, they spent billions of dollars building stupid schools. This is how stupid the American. This is reality. The first printer machine into the Middle East was by the French people. Nobody knows how to read in Algeria. Nobody knows how to read and write in Morocco. Nobody knows how to read and write in, 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 I mean, all those countries. When the old men, they came, what the old men do? They kidnap women from their husbands. To the point every Middle Eastern in the Middle East starts forcing his wife to wear a burqa. When the French there, not even a single woman was kidnapped. This is what Muslims do. You are complaining about the Christians. Even those who you call them a Christian, when they went to India, in India they were burning their own wives when the husband died. Very racist culture, divide between the poor and the rich. Who made you in Pakistan have a state? It was the Christians. Who made Pakistan even have a nuke? It was the Christians. You complain about everything when you have no life without the Christians. And when you want to seek refuge, you, you go where? You go to the Christians. Have you ever heard of a Muslim seeking refuge in Saudi Arabia, Emirates, Bahrain, Qatar? No. Egypt? No. Algeria? No. Morocco? No. All of you, you run away from Muslim countries. Hypocrites. None of your land is your land. And even what this have to do with my topic right now, Allah, he said, uh, maybe. You know what? Maybe one day you can debate Christian Prince. Maybe. Maybe one day we'll get a Muslim he answer anything. A god of penises. <clears throat> you miss uh, hadith, lies and deception. Hmm. 
from West of Africa. Let us take this guy from Ghana, from Africa. Answer, Abdul, answer. So this guy, he is saying to me, you give wrong interpretation, but he don't want to answer my call. Potato. Potato. And he is saying to me, you don't pick up a call. Can you believe it? Abu Bakr Yusuf. It might be ultimate fault coming again because he is still. He has my fingers marks all over. Answer. Okay, take a hike, potato. Who's next? Who's next? Maybe one day you will find somebody he can answer. Maybe, maybe one day you will go to heaven and Allah will make your penis endless, maybe. Maybe, have you ever heard of a prophet? He says that your wife in heaven, her ass will be one mile. Isn't it obvious that this person have a mental illness? I mean, why one mile? What about two miles? Is it bigger, better? What if I want to invite my friends to do hunting and hiking in the top of this wife's ass? Especially hiking is going to be so smooth, it's going to be very challenging to hike over it. If the ass alone is one mile, the vagina is how big? Any Muslim can give us an answer? When you have a prophet, he says that shaitan, he pisses in your ears, sleep in your nose, play with your belly bum, round himself around your penis, play with your anus. Isn't it this is a proof that this book is written by a mentally ill person? Prove me wrong. Anyone have little brain? How in the world he believe in such a garbage? Hmm? It is very clear that this religion is made by a mentally ill person. You do not need to be genius. I was sitting once and I was half in the shade and half in the sun. So my teacher told me that I shouldn't do that. When I asked for the reason, he said, because this is where shaitan sits. So he is asking me, can you elaborate? Yeah, I can easily elaborate. This is what the Prophet told us, alayhi salatu wasalam. That's it. This is the genius Muhammad. Don't sit in the, in the shade, half in the shade, half in the sun. Why? Because shaitan, brother, shaitan said there. Okay, let us say for the sake of a stupid argument. Shaitan, he said there. What's my problem? What will happen exactly if we sit half in the shade, half in the sun, and a Muslim can help us? Let us say, let us say, Shaitan he said his ass, his ass, half in the shade, half in the sun. What does this have to do with me? What will happen to me if I sit like 
in the same location half in the shade shade half in the sun what that have to do with anything isn't it this is a proof that islam is written or made by a mentally ill person i was sitting once and i was half in the shade and half in the sun so my teacher told me that i shouldn't do that when i asked for the reason he said because this is where shaitan sits so he is uh, asking me, can you elaborate? Yeah, I can easily. Look easy, can I elaborate? What's wrong with you? Come on, this is easy. Is it easy? I can, like, I will explain to you very well. And now he explain, how he explain? He said, uh, the prophet says so. That's it? This is the explanation? Okay, the prophet says so, what, why? Why he said so? What will happen if we said there? Let us try. I will go right now, sit half in the shade, half in the sun. I want to see what will happen to me. Do you must use your brain? Isn't it clear that Islam is made by a mentally ill person? And I believe in the existence of Allah. So anything else is by default. By default. Therefore, Therefore when we wake up, yeah. we sniff water up our nostrils nostrils three times three times why three times we muslims we are against the trinity but everything we do in life at three times makes sense even when they go to the bathroom they have to shake their penis three times if you shake it fourth it's going to fall apart the screws will come out trust me brother if you shake it four time it's going it's going to come off then you, what you would do you would give it back you have to do it three times everything three times so now you wake up in the morning we start with number three but they are not the, i mean if a christian he do that i can say okay the christian they believe in trinity in the name of the father the name of the son and all the spirit what those people are doing what why you start your day with number three we sniff water up our nostrils nostrils three times and blow it out why 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 the prophet tells us because satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils it's not written by a mentally ill person muhammad is a smart i mean come on this is must be from god who can deny such a fact nobody face it shaitan is deep in your nose all of you muslims but a slow motion camera in front of your nose when you are asleep and don't forget to make a slow motion okay hmm? slow motion this is religion did you see that? No. no, but you believe it and do it. We believe it and do Those it. who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan urinates in their ears. Have you felt the urine? Are you sharing it to me? You, are, you did not feel it, brother? I mean, come on. Are you saying you did not feel the urine of Shaitan, brother? Who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time. Satan urinates in their ears. Have you felt the urine? I said no, I haven't seen Satan to be to, to feel his urine. Likewise, when you is that an invisible, hard to feel urine? Do you think it's like a special stru structures? It is a urine, but you cannot feel it. But it's your urine. It's a urine, but you cannot see it. Is it amazing? Uh, 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 Griff, don't come here again. I don't want like stupid question. Watch my my program here. You will see almost every time we go live on air, you will see Muslims leaving Islam. Sixteen thousand Muslims leaving Islam a day, according to Al Jazeera TV. Six millions a year. Al Jazeera TV, not the Christian TV, and the Sheikh was a crime. Six million of Muslims a year. It's the size of a country. This is the size of the population of Israel alone.
and just to show you how desperate they are they are converting you know when when people leave islam nobody make videos because they're afraid for their life when one person he convert to islam they make a thousand video for the same person but in reality all of you are out of islam the proof that all of you are out of islam none of you follow islam none Did you see me in hijab wearing a jeans have holes in it? Is that what the Prophet taught? Isn't it your Prophet? He says that the one even whose his pants touch his 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 uh, uh, his ankle, he, he will never enter heaven. Did you see Muslim women wearing fashion jeans and the jeans going all the way through in the garage? And they have tens of kilograms of makeup. And they are taking selfies, posting it in Facebook. Is that what your prophet said? Isn't it your prophet? He says, even the one who draw an image or take an image or make an image, Allah will send him to hell and he will force him to blow all entire, like let's say, eternity. To blow at the image to make it alive. None of you is a Muslim. Find me one Muslim, don't listen to music. Music is haram, chess is haram, art is haram. Even the ring of a bell is haram. Do you have a ring at home? None of you follow Islam. Islam is dead long time ago. All of you are a bunch of hypocrites creating a new religion of Islam. The true Islam nobody listen to and nobody want to do and nobody want to follow. Nobody. And your scholars, they are getting you busted. You bring people to make interview. You are desperate to the point even you are joining with atheist. Atheist. Can you believe it? Atheist. Just hoping you can fight us, but you cannot. If Anas mentioned if this book was from other than God, they would have found in it many contradictions. If a book is without contradictions, that has no bearing on whether it comes from God or not. I've had phone books that are inerrant, but I certainly don't think God gave them. <laughs> that we believe without understanding. Take this wig of flag, you son of That the standard narrative has holes. The prophet tells us because Satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils. Those who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan urinates in their ears. I really do think Jesus was crucified and that he really was dead and buried. He, he thought that he was a son of God in the sense that he was. Do you see what happened when, you, when a stupid Abdul, he invited an atheist to join armed forces with Allah against Christianity? This is how evil Islam is. How a person, he claimed that he have a belief in God, he's asking somebody, deny everything in the Quran to come and help. And not only that, he just got him busted. He just showed him that the one who wrote the Quran is stupid. When you say to me, Allah, he said, if there's this book from God will be no contradiction. He said to him, I have a yellow pages. He compared literally the yellow pages to the Quran in front of his face. And then he said to him, I believe it truly that Jesus was crucified, which means the Quran is a book of lies. And not only that, he was buried. And not only that, he taught that he is the son of God. So what is the purpose of this interview? Stupid. They are so desperate. But I will tell you what they said to themselves. They said to themselves, maybe, like their God. Their God, he said, maybe first. Maybe. Maybe we invite an atheist and maybe this atheist will help us against Christianity. Maybe. But it's not working. Maybe if you divorce your wife, maybe Allah will exchange them for you. Maybe. The God of maybe. This God, he is not sure about anything. Even Muhammad, he made a verse in the Quran saying, you see, Muhammad he is predicting how he will die. So he decided to give us the prediction, which nobody can deny, brother. So what he said, read and love. This is a prophet? 
Muhammad is a messenger, like other messengers. And all messengers before him, they pass away. Here it says, like whom? No, it says, Qad which means all messengers before him pass away, which means the Quran again made a mistake because Jesus supposedly did not pass away. If you change the translator, I think you will find a new translation. New Quran, I mean. But anyway, maybe, where is the verse? Stupid. Here we go. You see, they put between two brackets, many. That's false. It says all messengers before they pass away. They try to fix an error. If he dies or killed, I mean, if there's a third option, this is the God of the Abdul making a prophecy. If he died or killed, this remind me of me being an Arabian prophet. Once a woman, she asked me, what do you think? I will have a child, boy or a girl. I said, let me tell you, let me prophesy. It's going to be either a girl or a boy. And then after six, eight, eight, seven months, she said, she gave birth. She said, wow, it was a girl. How you know? This is a prophet of God. You do not know how he will die. So if he die or get killed, this is deep. How come here, you know, maybe if he die, maybe if he get killed. I'm terrified. Yeah, we are terrified. This is why we open our Skype and we, we make your shish kebab. You see how terrified we are? To the point we challenge you, the big of you and the small of you. And for me, I don't debate atheists. Somebody want to convince me that he was a monkey. You won't. You are a monkey. I am out of bananas. But you are going to be really desperate to bring an atheist to fight with you to prove your religion. This is how stupid you are. This guy don't believe even in God. So when when an atheist and a Muslim, they join forces to sustain you, Islam is evil. Because there's no true believer he will do such a thing. Join forces with the one who deny God. Nobody. In the same time, you will see that Muhammad, he is willing to do that too. He is no different. Muhammad is join forces with everybody as long as he can get the benefit of it. Evil. They have This religion has no, let us say, uh, 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 dignity, no... Uh, uh, it's not faithful it's a, just a gang it's a political system it's about how we can win a ground not about how we can win heart even Muhammad himself he made a verse in the Quran saying that you can buy a belief actually those who became the caliphate of Bani Umayyad in Damascus Muhammad he bought them and the story in the Quran Can you believe it? It's allowed to buy a believer, to buy literally. Muhammad, he paid money to this family of Abu Sufyan. In order to believe in Islam, he could not make him believe. Who would do such a thing unless he is from the devil? Any Muslim can tell me? What kind of religion it says you can pay people to convert because those people, I cannot kill them by war. I cannot fight them, but I can buy them. They are evil. Let us give them money. They convert and they will join the gang. And this is exactly what happened to this family. They are gang. They are evil people like Muhammad. Muhammad could not force them to convert. 
So he come to Abu Sufyan and his family, said to them, listen, I will give you gold, silver, money, goats, camels, and he did. You read the interpretation of chapter 9, verse number 60. It says to you clearly that he paid them money to convert. Why them? Because they are evil criminals. He wanted to scare the rest. If we make this guy join me, the rest will join because he will kill them. Literally. Do we have any Abdul? <clears throat> All right. Let us see the interpretation here. Hmm. Read carefully. <laughs> And those who their heart are reconciled, so they might become a Muslim, or that Islam may be firmly established, or that peers might become a Muslim, or that might defend Muslims, all whom close according to different category. What we do? We pay him, we pay them money. And this is the story of this family who later took over the caliphate for centuries. So Islam is spread by Bani Umayyah. Bani Umayyah are the gang and the Quran witnessed that. And they did not convert to Islam until he paid them, literally. Any Muslim will say it's not true, open any interpretation you want. And those who their heart will be to reconciled by giving gifts as Abu Sufyan and his companion, there were 15 men. <laughs> he gave them money to convert. Why? Because those are the leaders of a big, strong, powerful criminal family. Read Ibn Kathir, real Qurtubi, real Tabari. A bribe. They converted to Islam by a bribe. This is who is Muhammad is. He could not make them Muslims by convincing them. He could not make them Muslim by forcing them. So he bribed them. This is the truth. When somebody is saying mis misinterpreting, I'm showing you your interpretation, you idiot. I mean, this is your this is this is Tafsir Ibn Abbas. Shall I show you Ibn Kathir? I mean, look at the stupid people. He is misinterpreting. I'm showing them their interpretation. We are reading their own words, and they say, I am misinterpreting. Crazy, mental. Somebody saying, Christian Prince, he cannot explain the doctrine of the Trinity. Well, I cannot explain to a mule who believes that Shaitan is in his nose. Shaitan play with his anus. Because you are busy now. You are trying to protect your anus from Shaitan. Your focus is not with me. Your focus is in your anus. Are you watching your anus? Have you ever heard of a prophet saying, Shaitan, when you are praying, come to you and take care from your anus? Prove it to us, Mr. Trinity. This is what you are worried about now, the Trinity. And look at this religion. If we say to the Muslims, why Allah have a shen? They say, so what? Allah have a shen. So why, so why you are asking how come God can be three in the same time one? If it's possible for God to be God, it's possible for God to be anything. Is it, if there is something impossible for God? Hypocrites. Why Allah have five fingers? They don't know. Why Allah have two hands? They don't know. 
So the question only happened when the God of the Christians, anything he is, they question it, but when it's their God, they go mute. Why your God will show his shin? Is he a trapeze girl? And why your God have a shin? Is he playing with Muhammad Salah? Football? The shin God? They say to you, how God can be a man? Well, is it your God is a man too? Here we go. Your prophet describe your God as a man. He's a fat man, heavy seated, big ass. The only difference between him and the false messiah, and the false messiah is a man, the only difference between them is just one eye. The rest is the same. Read it. Why Muhammad is worried that the Muslim they might think that the false messiah is Allah? Because they look the same. So he decided to give them a way to know which one is Allah, which one is the false messiah. What is the different one eye? Well, when, when Muhammad he says Allah, he made Adam in his image, he was copying the, the book of Genesis, the Old Testament. This is how silly this cult is. They say to you, Allah is not a man. Well, so why Muhammad worry that you will be confused between him and the Dajjal when the Dajjal is a man? The Dajjal not only a man, he will say, I am the, I am the Christ. So why he is worried that I am afraid that you might not understand his right. Muslim will not understand. I mean, how, how you can make a Muslim understand? Mission impossible. Muhammad, he knew what, what he have. The pagan, look at this idiot. This idiot, he tried to solve it. He made it blind. Let me show you what he just said. The Hadith is speaking to the pagans, but the pagans don't listen to Muhammad. <laughs> the pagans don't believe in Antichrist, potato. <laughs> potato, you are so cute. Did, did your mom, she grow more of you in the backyard or you are the only cucumber? The pagan believe in the Antichrist? Really? Is that the atheist? <laughs> Stupidity is amazing. No, no, no. That hadith is so that pagan like you don't misguide and think that the Jal is God. But he's afraid that the Muslims will believe because those who listen to Muhammad is the Muslims. We Christians, we listen to Jesus. We don't listen to Muhammad. <laughs> Stupidity is amazing. I bet you you were thinking for 10 hours, huh? That was deep. <coughs> and let us say he was talking about the pagans. <coughs> Still, what that would have to do with anything? Stupid. Still, Allah looked like a man. He's talking to the pagans, he's talking to the Hindus, he's talking to the Buddhas. Still he is comparing the look of Allah with the look of a man. And he's saying the difference between them is just one eye. <laughs> I mean, look how smart they are. Who care he's talking to? Your God Allah, he is perfectly matched to the point your prophet is afraid. Afraid what? You might be confused. Who said the word confused? It doesn't say that, CP. Here it says if you are confused. In fact, this hadith confirmed that Jesus is God. Why? Because here the person, he claimed to be the Messiah. So Muhammad should compare between him and the true Messiah. Instead, he compared between him and Allah. Because this guy is not even saying I am Allah, he's saying I am the Messiah. 
So Muhammad, he made a poo-poo. By saying what he just said, he just confirmed that Jesus is God because this person trying to replace Jesus, the God. Right? Don't be a coward and have a debate with Pad Rahman. I do not need to debate him. However, make him call me and let us laugh. Already I have what I want from him. What more I want from him saying that Jesus was teaching that he is a son of God. He's an atheist. What do you expect from him? Don't be a coward. The guy, he just confirmed that Jesus himself, he told that, which means Muhammad is a fraud. Here we go. Did you hear it? Love. Love at the stupidity of your religion. Jesus, he taught. Do you think Jesus was crucified <laughs> and that he really was dead and buried? He, he thought that he was a son of God. And the son That's it. I do not need to debate him. I got what I want. So we Christians, we ask ourselves, did Jesus teach that he is God? This is your friend, the friend of Islam. He says, yes, he taught that. It's not a corrupted Bible teaching that. So he got you busted. And he got Muhammad busted. And he made you shish kebab in your own interview. I mean, if an interview made by Muslims, we get this result. How horrible this interview is. In the interview made by Muslims inviting an atheist to fight the Christianity, he confirmed that the Quran is a fraud. The Quran lie about the crucifixion of Jesus. Jesus, yes, he was crucified. Jesus, yes, he was buried. And Jesus, yes, he taught that he is the Son of God. Your interview. I will debate him about what? <laughs> the rest is an atheist. He believes he's a monkey. I agree. If somebody want to convince me that he is a monkey, what I can say to him? You are not? I will be a fool. I'm not going to waste my time speaking about somebody who thinks he is coming from the zoo. But it's very funny to bring somebody who believes he's coming from the zoo to fight the Christians. And that makes you really look like a monkey. Allah have many shape. I mean, those Muslims do not even know what Allah is. If I ask right now the Muslims, if I ask any Muslim in the world, who is Allah? All of they say to me is God. Who, what, okay, what Allah mean? Every one of them, he will give you different definition. And they will try to find an answer. They don't know even what the word mean, because this is a foreign God. The word Allah is not an Arabic word. They are worshiping a foreign God. They have no idea. The same one they say, Mikhail. Okay, what make me then no? Well, Jibreel. Jibreel is the one who built Quran. Jibreel he came to the Muhammad. Jibreel he, he squeezed Muhammad. Okay, what Jibreel mean? Didn't know. Why? Because this is a foreign angel. He he was imported. He was imported. Everything in Islam is a counterfeit. It is something stolen from other religion. Zero Islam. The black stone is from the Hindu. The Yemeni corner is from the moon temple of, of in Yemen. If you touch them, it will erase your sin, Muhammad said. Somebody saying, can you give correct translation for chapter 21, verse number 8? No problem. Before we go there, uh, somebody says to me, in email, please guys, don't email me in Patreon. Here, I am staying with you for many hours. Don't email me in Patreon. If you have a questions, you can ask it here. Before we go to chapter 21, 8, somebody says, a Muslim, he told him that uh, uh, Muhammad, he predicted uh, that the Roman, they will win after defeat. My friend, first of all, this prophecy, if we can call it prophecies, Muhammad, he gave it after it happened. To make it simple, Trump, he won in the election in 2016. So now today I'm going to tell you that Trump, he won, he will win election in 2016. Read it. This verse revealed after they were victorious. And this is the reference, and this is Sahih. 
And if we go by the date of this uh, prophecy, we will find that even if we don't have this hadith, still the prophecy is wrong because it took them more than 16 years after to win. But according to the story here, Muhammad, he got this prophecy after it happened. <laughs> now we go Quran, chapter 21, 8. Stupidity is amazing. They are desperate to find God in our books, but they cannot find him in their good, in their, in their, in their books. All right. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to tell you about this verse. I mean, as usual, Muhammad is a, is a you know is a is a mentally ill. Uh, uh, if you want to connect to understand verses in the Quran, you have to connect other verses. As an example. Let us show you here. <clears throat> we will put this one here and we will put next to it other verse. Just to show you how stupid Muhammad is. In chapter 17, verse number 95, the one who asked the question, focus with me. It says, Say, had angels been walking about in peace on the earth, we would surely send to them an angel from heaven as messengers. So what this verse is saying? If the one who live in this earth were angels, then Allah will send an angel. Are you following with me? But this is destroy Islam because Allah He sent an angel, his name is Jibreel to Muhammad. So Allah should not send anyone to Muhammad as an angel because only Allah will send angels to earth if the one who live in the earth we are angels the person who is asking me do you know how many Christians they convert to other religion my friend you can say whatever you want watch my show and see how many Muslims leave Islam that's what we count for your Muslims are leaving Islam left or right and Christianity is the biggest faith on earth China is the biggest country in the world is coming to Christ as unbelievable unbelievable so the coming China, we pray to the Lord that soon, soon, the communist Chinese government will turn into Christian government. Praise the Lord. And now I have my Chinese book, by the way, The Deception of Allah for free, in Chinese, for free. So imagine how many Chinese will leave Islam too, from the Muslims. But look with me. Muhammad is a fool person, mentally ill. He will not, his God, send an angel to the earth unless the one who live in the earth were angels. That's wonderful. Okay. Let us go to different verse. This is the verse you choose for us. We never sent before you, Muhammad, but men whom they were inspired Okay, so those are men, and we do we do not create them, those messengers, with body that ate not food, nor were immorals or immortals. So the Quran confirmed that all the messengers Allah He sent, they were men. 
who was the guy who sent me the, the request with his name? Who is the one who sent me the request to explain? Do you see how we have to connect the dots, how knowledge work? This is a clear contradiction. Allah here in chapter 21, if we can say Allah, this is Muhammad, confirming that Allah never, ever, ever send a messenger to mankind unless he is a man. And those men, they eat food. Those men, they eat food. So what we will do with this verse? Any Abdul? <laughs> Allah will never send a messenger, he's an angel. Never. Allah send only messengers who they are men. Why? Because he is sending them to men. Okay, makes sense. No problem. So the story of Jibreel is a fraud then. Because Allah will never ever send a messenger as an angel to anyone unless he himself or the people are angel people. They are not human like us. If the one who live in the earth, they were angels, then Allah will send a messenger as an angel. If we ask the Muslims, was Jibreel a messenger? They will say yes. He was sent to who? They will say to Muhammad. But the Quran says, Allah will never send an angels. Unless the one who he is sending to, they are angels too. Do you see how stupid this book is? Do you see how easy we prove that Muhammad is mentally ill? And the funny Mimi Hijab, he says to uh, uh, to Rahman that this book is uh, Allah. He says, if this is book from other than Allah, you will find a lot of contradiction. The guy, he said to him, well, you know what? I have your pages have zero contradiction. The Quran is the book of contradictions, the book of stupidity. And Yellow Pages is way more respected, organized book. You read the Quran, you have no idea what this God is talking about, to the point you need to read tons of interpretation. And after the interpretation, the Muslim scholar, they agree not to agree about the meaning of this verse. And not only that, things go far with the stupid Quran. To the point, even the Quran maker, he says, Allah only knows what the Quran meant. Can you believe it? The one who knows what the Quran meant is Allah only. Muslim don't. <laughs> what about what about Muhammad? Do he knew? No, he do not know too. Only Allah knows. Imagine the thief Muhammad because he's a fraud. You know, if I go right now and say, I want to teach you mathematics. And then I say to the student, oh, sorry, don't ask me this question because only Einstein knows what he meant. So I forbid them from asking questions because I do not know what I'm talking about. Muhammad is a thief. He was saying things you do not know what they mean. He was copying the Jews, he was copying the Christians, he was copying the Hindus, he was copying the Buddhists. He copied. The second you ask him a question, he says, oh, there's a big part of the, my book. Allah, Allah, Allah knows, knows what it's mean. Mental. This is mental. What the point of sending me a book? Nobody knows what it's mean, save, save the one who wrote it. What for? It says to you, it says that the reason Allah He sent those verses because He want to deceive you. Look at the logic. I thought the Quran is the book of guidance. It turned to be no. <laughs> why do you? Why do blame Muhammad for his sin? He was a normal person. He himself was a sinner. Uh, ben, I don't know. Your questions is very silly. I'm not blaming him for his sin. You idiot. I did not. 
all of us we commit sin we read the verse the verse proved Muhammad is mentally ill because it says may Allah forgive your sin the one to come and the one in the past and who is the one is talking is Allah so if Allah is talking how he is not sure if he will forgive or not Allah is asking other Allah saying to him maybe but because you are slow you think I'm blaming him for the sin no I'm not slow stop drinking camel urine I never heard of a God he do not know he is not sure if the sin of this person is forgiven or not and what kind of God he want to forgive the future sin? Is that a license for sin? Open license? If the one is talking is Allah, how Allah, he say, so Allah may forgive your sin. And look at the first translation, shortcoming. The word sin became shortcoming. What is that, orgasm? The word sin becomes shortcoming. Muslims, can you believe it? How they lie to you in the translation. Muhammad, he, he comes so fast. The verse in the Quran says sin. The Muslim that translated as shortcoming. You change the translator only. You do not need to change the book, brother. Let's just translate the whole verse change. The shortcoming became sins. Don't talk to Muhammad, he comes so fast. Don't touch him, he's sensitive, shortcoming. So we are not blaming Muhammad for his sin, we are blaming Allah. He is God or not? Why God is asking other God, may Allah forgive? This is a prayer, this is a wish, this is a prayer. May I say to you, may God forgive you, because I'm not God, I cannot forgive you. But God, he's saying, may Allah forgive you? That is a stupid. But remember, it's shortcoming. <laughs> but don't do it here in the chat, okay? Don't make the floor slippery. Try to make it long coming in different place. So the Quran is written by a mental ill person. Big boobs, Gucci, Bracelet in heaven, house is made from gold and silver. What do we do with a house made from gold and silver? That's ugly. Go and color your house white, oh, sorry, uh, uh, yellow. Like you can buy actually, paint, look like gold. See how ugly it is. A house of gold, of silver. And not only that. Just to show you, to confirm to you how stupid Muhammad is. How the wives of the Muslims will be in heaven. Do you know how they will look like? Let me show you. I hope that Abdul will enjoy what they will see. Hmm. Here we go. This is how the wife, the version which Allah He promised us, let us put it on the screen, will look like. Is it? This is a proof that Muhammad is mentally ill. I challenge any Muslim to tell me that this is not stupid. Muhammad, he promised the Muslim men that those women, they will be so white to the point we can see the marrow of their bones. If you want to say to me, there's no such a thing, get me busted. Here we go. And this is Sahih al-Bukhari. You can't say it's weak. You can't say it's rejected. Everyone will have two 
wives from the hoys who will be so beautiful pure transparent the marrow of their bones of their legs will be seen through the bones and the flesh do you see it abdul and this is sahir bukhari mental so what muhammad meant by this this is how your wife will look like are we making things up or this is what your prophet said here we go we see her marrows are you getting excited Allah will give you a jellyfish this is what the beauty is but because Muhammad is a perverted man he is obsessed and his followers at that time with the white women until now actually nothing changed If you go and see the Muslim making videos about the wife of uh, what his name, uh, 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 Samir Abdullah, talking about his white wife, they are jealous because he have a white wife. Isn't it? This is a proof that Allah, Aka Muhammad, is mentally ill. What is that? So I will believe in him. I will get a jellyfish, and this is supposed to be sexy, and you know it. Sahih al-Bukhari is the most authentic book. What Munkar? So, we finish with this. This is a clear proof that Muhammad is mentally ill. There's no way a person will make such a promise. And no way a person will believe in such a promise unless he himself is mentally ill too. Because this is not fun. So I spend my life joining Al-Qaeda and ISIS to get this. This is my wife in heaven. I will see the poopoo in her ass. I will see the shish kebab in her stomach. I will see the marrow of her bones. And this is from God. Somebody saying, can you make a video about Allah is not the creator? My friend, all of this is obviously Allah is not the creator. Even Allah himself, he confessed his sin, saying that he is not the only creator. I do not need to make a video about it, but take two seconds. Have you ever heard of a God? He says he is the best of the creators. <laughs> Mentally ill. How you spend your day telling us that God, your God, is one God, and then you say to us that Allah is the best of the creators. If he is the best of the creators, that means there's many creators. If he is, there's no creator, that means Allah is lying here. Because he's not the best of the creators. And then a smart Abdul, he tried to fix it. He says, oh, he meant like, you create a bicycle, okay? Allah is, uh, so the creation in religion is about giving life, creating something from nothing. So when you say, I am the best of the creators, you're not comparing yourself to a guy making bicycle. Stupid. Even your Quran is saying that you should worship the one who make even a, who cannot even make a fly. Based on this, Jesus is God because Jesus, he created a bird from the mud. Chapter 22, verse number 73. So the Quran confirmed that a creator is the one who at least can create a fly, not a bicycle. That is Jesus, my friend, even in their book. Jesus, in, the, in their book, he made it from the mud, a form of a bird, and he breathed into it. So as we speak right now, according to the Quran, we have a flying birds made by Christ. Praise his name. Stupid mentally Al Muhammad. He's trying to prove that Jesus is not God, but yet he made Jesus creator. And the Muslim, they will say to you, by the will of Allah, who care? He, he is a creator then. He have the ability to create. The Quran says, lakum. I create for you. And you know when you say by the will of Allah, who cares for this claim? I can say that I am the one who gave Jesus the power. Anyone can claim. But what confirm is that Jesus, he have it. Did I answer you guys? Any other question before we go? I think we are done for today. Don't forget to leave your comment. 
and uh, I, you know, I like really to see the Christians thinking, uh, not only me refuting the Muslims, and I want Muslims to refute us too. You know, what, what the Muslims, they do, they have nothing to say, they post links for us. You know, go watch this very guy, go, why you don't call him to call me? So we can laugh. Why you don't call your sheikh to debate me? Do you dare? Somebody saying, look at the gospel of, of, uh, of Thomas. You know, Ben, you are, a, uh, you are a very silly person. I think you, have a, you are suffering from diarrhea. When you say to somebody, look at the gospel of, then you have to give him a gospel he accept. If I say to you now, go and look the Quran of Rashad Khalifa, you will say to me, I don't accept it. Stupid. Have you been ever in the court? In the court, my friend, you give a paper written by your enemy or your like the one you are against not something written by somebody else you don't agree with it stupid do you yourself agree with it do you agree with this when you call it thomas potato so the muslims are so desperate they mention to you that okay there's a bible it's called barnabas okay you muslim do you accept they say no it's fake so why are you asking me about it it's fake <laughs> stupid mentally ill Diarrhea. If the book you are asking me for or to speak about is not accepted by you, neither by me. So this will be used against who? Don't get married because your wife will suffer. She will not be proud about you. She will leave you. Stupidity is amazing. When I show you the Quran, I'm showing you a book you accept, not a book I don't you don't accept. Somebody saying you say all the angels of Islam brought by names. Open the Old Testament, Abdul. Do you have any proof? <laughs> do you have a proof that there is my do you have a proof that there is angels in the Old Testament? Do you have a proof? No, we don't have a proof. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh boy anyway i think we have a very good time together today uh muslims are very funny they do not know their religion obviously and you know they they say things anything just to defend their cult uh I don't know what to say. Uh, Mr. Santos, as Abdul, he's saying what it's mean to say gods, just to show you how stupid you are. The word Elohim is a word meaning gods, just to show you how silly you are. So Elohim is not a word meaning God. But at the end, when we say gods, you Muslim, you say, well, in the Old Testament, it's mentioned that there is a trinity, well, you just said it says gods, didn't you? Did you say that? So God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. So for us, it's not a problem because for us, we believe in Trinity. But for you, when you go and come with gods, what you can do with it? When Allah he says, if we want to take a partner, we take it from ourselves, our gods. What you can do with it? You will fix it? Hmm? In your religion, it doesn't make sense. In your religion, it doesn't make sense that Jesus is a son of no man, yet he is born. In Christianity, it makes sense. Because Jesus is the Son of God. If we ask Muslims why Jesus is a person have no father, they will say, Adam don't have a father, you idiot. Adam was not born. Right? You did not answer about angels being borrowed. Well, you know, you go and we have tons, tons of places mentioned the angel of God, all those names, Michael, 
Gabriel, uh, uh, even even the ones Muslims they don't even know they, like they don't know them much like Israel, uh, the angel of death. All of those are borrowed from the Jews and the Christians. And you do not need to be a genius about me answering you. You can just type the word Gabriel, angel Gabriel in Google. Let your Google be your helper in this in case you are so slow and you are a fool. And you will see that the first one who mentioned this angel had nothing to do with Islam. Do you like to call me and I will open Skype for you? And I will make you read? Are you there? Where is the guy who said you wanna? Do you like to call me? So we can make you read together with us? You know, when uh, <clears throat> when Muhammad and he try uh, uh, to prove a point, he always fail. Always, I never saw a Muslim he can prove anything, but I never saw a Christian prince he cannot. Do you want to call me? The one who mentioned it? Where are you? We answer you about that, Abdul. Ben, you keep posting the same thing, you idiot. Are you going to post the same thing over and over again? The guy who said you did not answer me, are you going to call me? Hmm. Now he go mute. <clears throat> I never saw a Muslim can answer a question. Never. About his religion, about his book, about his understanding, about even his God. So do you like to call me and I will show you how many times the names of those angels mentioned in the Bible? What was the name of this guy? Patates? Hey, Patates. Do you want to call me? Just so you can show everybody that, you know, we are not, it's not true. Is that fair, guys? You can show everybody that it's not true. <clears throat> All those names are starting from the Bible. All of them. Not even a single one. If we ask any Abdul, when you ask, you make a challenge. You get the challenge from where? This is the angel who came to Mary. What was his name? And the same we can show you from other you know books but anyway I mean they are silly and they are stupid and they are desperate and they do not know what to do the name is so clear that this is not an Arabic name Abdul Masoud Khan he want to call me okay Abdul Masoud text me Abdul Masoud <clears throat> I will make an exception for you I was going to leave but I will take Abdul Masoud because you sound like strong. <coughs> Text me, Abdul Masoud.
Did you text? I don't see any text from you. Abdul Masoud, are you there? You know, even the mean of the name proving that Muhammad is a false prophet. He stole it. Okay, text me. I don't see. What's your name? Your name there is Mas'ud too? I don't see anyone. His name is Mas'ud texting me. Maybe you are texting the wrong guy. <coughs> Sheezy? Okay, hold on, Sheezy. Let me find you. All right. <coughs> All right, here we go. I see you now. <coughs> Let me mute YouTube. How are you, sir? I'm fine. Go ahead. What do you want to say to us? Yeah, first of all, it's such a pleasure to talk to you. You're welcome, my friend. You are a Muslim? Yes, sir. You are indeed a very knowledgeable man. All right. You want your camera to be uh, you, you want your camera to be on, people to see you, or what? I don't know. Your camera is uh, it's up to you, sir. I don't I, I'll switch it off because it's not safe. All right. So what do you want to say to us? So I uh, let me switch it off first. I don't know. First time I'm using Skype actually. Okay, I'll just turn it the other way. So, yeah. All right. No, it's okay. okay. I, so, will, I will move it from your face. No problem. Go ahead. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. You can click yeah. at the camera. You can click at the camera and that will turn it off. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's done. Yeah. All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Go ahead. Yeah, I just want to tell you that uh, uh, just like in Christianity, they are really noble and good people in Islam. And I know you have nothing against the people. I understand that. But uh, but people are actually some people are really brainwashed into certain beliefs, and uh, I cannot say anything against you because uh, I'm not here to say that. But I believe that uh, we are we we grow up and we start uh, believing what our parents and our culture and our friends teach us and our teachers teach us, and then we become that. You know. So all religions have noble intentions, but uh, there are some problems uh, in the writing, in, in the understanding, in the beliefs, you know. Okay, my but friend, uh, let, let us make it short, you know, with my respect. Yeah. You. Uh, you said all religion have a noble purpose, right? Yes, sir. Okay, what is the noble purpose of Islam? Go ahead. Noble purpose of Islam, actually, which is not, uh, which is understood, is to respect your parents. Mm -hmm. is to love your friends okay and is to be a good person is to be honest is to not cheat okay. is to have a good life all right uh, that's so, a noble purpose okay. in, so, in the, so, yeah, when you, when, so when your prophet he said to a person who is proud about his parents he said to him go and tell him to buy the penis of your father is that respect to your parents yeah but that's uh, i know you will say it's an authentic uh, uh, hadith but let me tell you a story about the hadith tell me a story the story about the Hadith is that there are so many articles and books mm. regarding the Prophet that it won't fit a person in his lifetime. It's it's Why? it will be like a million people. Yes. It's like Why? like everything is there. How he was eating, what when he was sleeping, what time he went there. Everything is there, which is like so much. Mm. You cannot have so much content mm. about one single individual. Why it's not, not possible. So it's all. Why not? Hmm? Why not? Because it's just too much. It's like no, it's like if you start reading them, there's so many my books. Friend. Okay, let me see. Let yeah. me see. Is it yeah. is it you can you respect your parents if they are not Muslims? 
Of course I can, yeah. Okay, read for me chapter 58, verse number 22 in the Quran. Okay. Uh, let me look at the YouTube. Okay, I don't know. I can read Arabic, but I don't know Arabic. Don't so read Arabic. It's okay. Don't read Arabic. I'm not asking you to read Arabic. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Go to the English. <clears throat> Chapter 58. 58, verse number 22. You shall not find a people who believe in Allah in the last day befriending those who oppose Allah and His Messenger, even though they be their fathers or their sons or their brothers or their kindred. Hmm. Is that a good teaching? Yeah, if somebody is like, if somebody has left Islam, mm -hmm. if somebody has left Islam, then then um, they are trying to. Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Are I'm you there? there? Okay. If somebody has left Islam, they are trying to unite the ummah, the people around them, to tell them, hey, don't let them go. So it's just it's just uh, telling people to be united. You know, be, be together. Friend, what have, what does have to do be with united? A person, so parents, a person here is so your parents. You are the one who mentioned to me. You are the the one, my friend, you are the one who said Islam teach you to respect your parents. Here it says you yes. can't even take them as a friends. They are your enemies. What is respect? So a person, a mother, a mother, she gave you from hell milk. She spent her life teaching you and taking care of you when you are sick. She cried when you when you, when you are in pain. And now, just because you don't accept Islam, it says you, you will not find one Muslim. He is nice and good to those who believe not in Allah. So this is this is about your parents and your father and your mother. If they leave Islam, so don't be friends with them. Yeah, that, that's the bottom line. Yeah. So this, so this is a good, this is a good teaching. So remember, you are the one who said to me, you have I'm a no, just, you have a noble purpose. So is that a no, is that a noble purpose? It's just the purpose to unite the family. It's not to what unite. No, this is divide the family because if I cannot take my brother and my mother and my sister and my father as a friends. I'm dividing the family and I'm making them my enemies. Yeah, but if, if a family member leaves a religion, that's more of a division in a family. My Don't friend, so, so what? It says here, you will not be found. You are Duna. You are Duna, which means will be kind, will be nice, will be friend, will be, uh, uh, they will love them. So Islam teaching you to hate your own parents and you are the one who told me we have a, neighbor, a noble purpose. But things, of like this, but things like this are in every religion. You read the Bible, you read the, uh, uh, the Hindu books. No, my Buddhist friend. Buddhist. No, my friend. You will see in the Bible it says that the family would be divided against each other, but not because Jesus he wanted to divide them, but because they follow Jesus. That family they are hating you, not you hating them. Yeah, but it's, it, since you're talking about the family, isn't it true that a divorced woman cannot get married again? A divorced woman cannot be married again. Yeah. You mean in the Bible? Yes. No, because you see, you, because you are not uh, a person you who knows. No, 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 no. Yeah. This is not true. This is not true. No, this is not. This is not. Let me answer, let me answer you. Let me answer you. A divorced woman, she is divorced from adultery because a divorce should be divorced from adultery. So adultery mean in the Bible is a great sin against God. Like the Bible says, the earth committed adultery. So adultery not necessarily a fornication of sex. Hold on. Let me explain. Let me explain. Let me explain, please. So adultery is. Anyone who break the command of God. So if a man leave his house, he's, he, he committed adultery. If the woman, she leave the husband, she committed adultery. So if a person, he committed such a adultery against the promise to be united, that person shall not marry. And because a divorce in that woman or divorce in that man, that person is already divorced from adultery. So remarrying a person who is divorced from adultery is forbidden. But what marriage has to do with adultery? She was married. She never had an affair after marriage. No, because what divorce, marriage? you see, you are not listening. You are the one who called the verse. Obviously, you do not know how to read it. It <laughs> says, it says divorce from adultery. The women, the, the women, your women, oh, only yeah. women can be divorced from adultery. And any woman, anyone who marry such a person, he is committing adultery. So this woman, she is divorced because of what? Because of adultery. So when you marry someone, she did fornicate that will make you a fornicator and this is the verse in the quran by the way look like you do not know your book yes sir i'm not as, as educated as you are obviously okay. what is what, what, what about slavery then what, is, what, is, 
You see, what, what you are, you are like? jumping from place to place to place. You see, I ask you, my friend, I, I ask, I, I, I ask you, I, I ask you, what is the noble of Islam? Chapter here, chapter twenty-four, verse number three. Noble of Islam is to be good, to read, be a good person. Me. Okay, read for, read for me, read for me, read for me. Chapter chapter twenty-four, verse number three. Yes, sir. Okay, what, I have to what read. What kind it. of logic is this logic? Show me, please, sir. Chapter 24, verse number three. Uh, in, can you show me in English? Yeah, I can see it now. Mm. One second. Yeah, uh, it's like, it's about the third marriage, yeah? It's about the second marriage. You have to be divorced three times or something like that. No, this is not about second marriage. Are you are you deaf? Are you are you blind? Read it. Tell me. Where is second marriage? Because where where it says second it's, marriage? It's, where it says second where, where is the word second marriage is coming from? The adulterer marries not but an adulteress or a mushik. Okay. Adulterer not, not necessarily married, because married married adulteress in Islam, she will be stoned. Okay. 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 So, adulterer, adulteress, okay. she have to marry adulteress. What kind of logic is that? I don't understand this logic, but it has to be reviewed more. Yeah, yeah. so you don't understand your logic. So you are a person who can understand the logic in the Bible and you have a question about it, but you never read your book. Now let I'm, me, I'm, I will give you, I will give you, I'll give you more opportunity. Give me one noble thing about Islam until now you failed. Continue, go ahead. One noble thing what Islam has done? Yeah. What Islam has achieved? Yeah. What do you mean by one noble thing? Like you, you, said, you said to me, my friend, I ask you, you in yeah. the beginning, you are the one who made an opening and says every religion have a noble purpose, right? Yeah. Is, it, is it noble to promise me that I will have big boobs if I believe in this God? Is that noble promise? Uh, it's 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 not a promise in the Quran. It's a promise in the Quran. Chapter seventy eight, chapter seventy eight, verse number uh, thirty three. Okay, let me read that. <clears throat> is that noble or this is a guy trying to get me horny, trying to, to make me sexually excited just to follow him blindly, trying to use my private part temptation to make me follow him? Is that really how messenger of God they speak? And this is how God he talk? He's talking about the women in heaven, yeah? Who care? He didn't even say the word women. Where is the word women? Show me the word women. I will shave my 25 foot. English is there and voluptuous women of equal age. No, my friend. No, my friend. This translation says women. There's no women there. I, I wish there were women. It says in Arabic, nowhere the word women mentioned. So show me the right translation, please, sir. There's no right translation. All of Muslims, they lie. And voluptuous of equal age. Well, there, just so we there's, no age, there's no equal age. There's no equal age. There's no equal wage, my maybe friend. There's no, women. there's no equal wage in the in, sorry age in the verse. Atraba, it's mean they are similar. Atraba from the word torab, which means dust. So all the dust they have similar uh, 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 fine texture. So atrab is the same. Uh, age, not maybe. age, did not mention. And it says kawaib. They have a cube. Cube what? You go to Arabic, you will see that the kawaib is the uh, is the female. When her breast is just coming out, so she is just a little tiny child, female, start getting to have breast, not big boobs, kawaib. This is why there are firms coming out. A woman, when she gets older, when she gets mature, she will have a different look of her breast, and they will be like a little bit coming down. Those are cube, like the Kaaba. So what kind of God he promised me to be a child molester, seduce me, to follow One him. Second. Does it say? Does it say in Arabic women? No, no word. Show me the word. So, maybe, maybe, so how how are we assuming these are women? I don't know. I'm not assuming. It's it's so because are, I'm not. I'm not are some other no, time. because the word some, because the word kawaib, the word kawaib is for the breast of women, but the word women is not there. Okay, maybe these creatures have breasts like women. 
Oh, so they are not women, but Allah will give you those creatures to have sex with them. Yeah, because it doesn't say women. Yeah, you okay, told me. So is that no way? So is that, maybe it's a dog. Have seven boobs. No, but Allah won't give dogs. Yeah, he's, he's God. What do you he mean? will give someone don't even you, better. Don't you know that Allah have a dog? Allah has a dog? Yes. No, I don't know that. Okay, if we go to chapter uh, uh, and in verse number two, it says one and two. It says uh, 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 the cousin of Muhammad. He says, "Aren't you afraid that dog of Allah will eat you?" And then Allah He sent His dog and He ate the guy. But, but, but do you think the dog of Allah will be the same as like the dog on earth? So Allah He called him a dog, a dog but he's a rabbit. Maybe he's a dog of another kind. You know, maybe it's... <laughs> what other it's, kind? It's, it's, my friend, my friend, you see, you are a nice guy. I don't want to be rude to you, you know? E excuse me, because I am a person who speaks naturally. So I don't want you to be, feel to be insulted. Is that okay? I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Okay. Please forgive me if I no. something bad. So, no, no, I'm, I'm not saying... I'm, I'm saying to you, don't be upset from me if I use words which hurt. No, no, I'm, I'm your fan. I, okay. I'm your fan. You're right. very knowledgeable. So when, when Allah, when, when your prophet, he says a dog, then you say maybe it's not a dog. I mean, what's what is that? Is that a joke? Are you making fun of me? Are you are, are we going to make fun of each other? So if you're a prophet, he said See, it's another word. It's heaven. Yeah. So maybe it's the dog of heaven. Who knows what it is? But you just said there's no dogs in heaven. I didn't say that. Oh, I, okay. I love dogs. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you love dogs. So why you're a prophet? Okay, we will go then. Why you're a prophet? He ordered to kill, to kill all the dogs. Well, I don't know if it's true. What do you mean it's true? I don't know if it's true. Let me ask you, whatever you know about your prophet, you learn about it from where? From the Hadith. From the Hadith. So the Hadith says so. So what do you mean it, you don't know if it's true? Yeah, but but uh, you, you 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 become selective with the Hadith. Uh, I, you I look know, at... My friend, I am, I am selective, but it still is there. Let us say I am selective. That will not change anything. So if I go to a restaurant and then I look at a dish and I found one fly in the whole table, and then you say to me, you're this, being selective, but it's a fly. This is what I was saying in the beginning, that there's so much material that it cannot be in of a person of a lifetime. You know, it has to be several lifetimes of my, several my people. Friend, I, don't, so I don't care. It's you, who, it's you who said to me, I said, how you know about your prophet? You said from the Hadith. Okay. Yeah. It's, well, this it's, is your book. Like, so can, uh, can I use right. your book against you as a, believe, as a believer? Yes. This is your book. Yes, you can. See, yes, you can. But, so but I cannot the use this book. I cannot use this book against I someone who is a Hindu. Certain points in every single book. What? Because I've read them. There, 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 is, there are things like this in Gita. There are things like this in Bible. There's, there are things like, like this in Torah. So, uh, okay, you hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, you see, this? Look, look what will happen. You notice, you know, like I am assuming always, you know, you sound like a nice guy and you are a mature person but the second we show you something embarrassing you just jump saying there is something here or something there already you fail you mentioned to me the divorce in the bible i showed you that this is you are wrong about it so why you go there i'm asking you why muhammad want to kill all the dogs you said you said you said you, said you love you? dogs you said you love dogs are you allowed even to have a dog did you answer me about slavery what about slavery what about the bible what does the bible say about slavery well, what Paul was there talking. Is, there is many forms of slavery. As an example, a Hebrew cannot enslave a Hebrew for more than seven years, which means a Hebrew person he go to a Hebrew person and says, "I want to be your slaves for two years, but what, three years, Indonesian four can, years." Can you enslave an Indonesian? Huh? Can you enslave an Indonesian? Can you enslave in what other yeah. nation? Well, the the, Jews, Hebrew, the hold on, enslave, my friend. Hebrew, you, can you, you, heard, an you, you heard that the Jews believe eye for an eye, correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. The whole nation of the Jews has been enslaved many times. So the same as you enslave me, I will attack you in war and I will take you, I will take you as a slave. So are you going to go blind or you will say this is what happened and this is true? So they enslaved them. They enslaved them back. It's a war. And that and that does not approve. All my friend, my friend, my, my, my friend, friend, hold on, hold on. In Islam, can you buy a slave? Can you buy a slave? In Islam, can you buy a slave? You see, when you talk about slavery, as if you are a Muslim who don't believe in slavery, do you Muslim believe practice slavery or not? No. Did your prophet own slaves? No. Like same like Bible. 
Okay, same hold on. Uh, hold on, my yeah, friend. My friend, no, not saying my your Bible. Here we go. Even you can rape them, even if they are married. Here we go. Can you deny the fact that friend, all my friend, friend, you have no idea. No, what are you Islamic. talking about? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Read with me. Read with me. Yeah. Okay. This is your book saying it's forbidden for you women who they are already married except your slaves. And you say to me, we don't have slaves in Islam. Your prophet, he yeah, owned thousands. Chapter 4, verse number 24. It says, forbidden for you women already married except the slaves, which means even if they are married, you can sleep with them. Is that the noble teaching you are talking about? They are from war. You know, they are, they are deprived people of war. A second ago, you said to me, we don't have a slavery. A second ago, you said, nowhere we can find it. And now you are saying it's from war. So what if it's a war? Why you want to rape a woman? She is married. She is married. The Bible says, the Bible says, if you capture a female, you make her shave her head. And if your son want to marry her, he cannot. He have to free her. He cannot resell her. Hold on. He cannot. He can. He have to marry her. He cannot resell her. He cannot abuse her. Your Quran saying women who they are already married, we can rape them. Why even mention the word of slavery in Bible? Why? Why See, you have to here we go. Okay. You, a second ago, you denied that slavery in the Quran. Yes, so, these things in all the books. What? There are such things in all the books. That's all I'm saying. No, that's not what you are saying. There's no. There's. We cannot compare. You cannot rape that woman. You cannot force her into bed. You can, you even, can make and you cannot even take a married woman. So here it says that you can take a married woman. You can force her into bed, and even you know that she is married. And now you have a Quran saying that it's forbidden for you married women, even. But Christian, for, as a but, Christian, as a Christian, let me ask you one question, sir. Hmm. Is it good to have slaves, my friend? You are being a hypocrite now. Is it good for to be to to, to have a, to have a slaves in, 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 according to you? No. Okay. So why you prophet no. have slaves then? No, but but the same in, in the Bible. So you are what what are you doing now? Are you saying to me both of us we have a slavery? So both of us we are bad. Are you? Is that, is that your point? No, that's not my point. That's not my point. I'm just <laughs> saying that you are picking and choosing. No, I am not uh, choosing. It's you who mentioned slavery, not me. So, so it's the same like in Bible. So why are you? No, only it's not the same. It's not the same. In war so time, those nations they have the, in this time they have a war with other nations. So they take slaves and they are themselves they've been taken as slave. But they are not going to rape the women. In your religion, you rape even married women. And let okay. Me, okay. Let, so let us make it simple. Let's make it simple. Is your prophet is a child molester? No. Did he marry a child? She is six years old. She married a child to unite the religion. He married a child. So he to married unite a child religion. a second ago. You said no. A second after you said he married a child. Thank you very much. She, he, my friend, he don't waste my time. Don't waste my time. You are just a, you're adult, but you are confused. You do not know what I'm talking about. You can call me some other time. All right. I have no time for for you know silly talk. This is silly talk. So did your prophet marry a child? No, he did not. Did Muhammad marry Aisha at the age of six? Yes, he married a child to unite the religion. That is even make it more ugly. That's mean Muhammad, he sex, have sex with the children, not for the purpose of marriage, for the other purpose. And what kind of a religion needs six years old a child vagina to unite it? You cannot unite Islam. You cannot make a religion of Islam without a vagina of a, a little child. Aren't you ashamed of what you said? Did your prophet marry a child? No. Did your prophet was? No. Did he marry Aisha at the age of six? Uh, he married a child to unite religion. What unite? Abu Bakr is a friend. He's a believer already. I mean, look even at the excuse. Abu Bakr is a believer. What unite religion? What does it have to do with unite religion? <laughs> they are desperate. They don't know what to say. Their prophet is perverted. The strategy is not working. And my friend, I hang up on you because you are just, I'm losing my patient. Maybe next time if you call me, call me earlier so we can laugh more. But as you see, you have no idea what are you talking about.
You know, when the Quran says, uh, you know, fornicator, marry a fornicator. So Muhammad should not marry anyone except a fornicator. When the stupid Quran says, good women, good women, they marry good men. So how there is a fornicator then? <laughs> if, if good men, they marry only good men, women. This is destiny of Allah. Okay. Then how in the world does a woman she fornicate to cheat her husband? Or how in the world the man he cheat in his wife? If Allah make a destiny that good women marry good men and good men marry good women and bad women marry good bad men and bad men marry... Look how he repeat himself like a stupid idiot. Like a broken record. So how we find that there is a woman she cheat in her husband or a man cheat in his wife if only good men marry good women and this is the destiny of Allah. Stupid book. This is a book written by a mentally ill person. Because if only Allah, he will make good women marry from good men, that means we should not have anyone having a problem. And Lord, have a bad news for you. You spoke about, uh, 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 you know, morality and noble. Is it noble that Allah, he opened a Harry Potter school to teach how to divorce your wife? He sent two angels, Harry Potter, even his name is to start with H, Harut, Harut and Marut. Allah he sent them down chapter 2 verse number 102 to open a school of a black magic to teach men how to divorce wives this is noble religion Allah opening a school of Harut and Marut and the purpose of the school is to teach him how we how we can do play magic so we can make a man divorce his wife what is this this is a noble purpose what is the purpose of this school? So if any of you is divorced, let me tell you the bad news. It was Harut and Marut. Harut and Marut, they came in the Babylon Tower. They opened a school of Harry Potter. They come down with the broom. And before you join that school, they make you sign a disclaimer. Look, disclaimer, read it with me. Read it, read it. It says here, Teaching, teaching magic, such a thing as come down in the Babylon to the angels Harut and Marut, but neither of those taught anyone such a thing without saying, disclaimer, disclaimer, we are only at trial, so don't bless me. They do learn from them the means to sow divorce, discord between the man and the wife. Change translator if you don't like it. Disclaimer. Allah, he sent angels, this is the noble purpose of Islam, to open a school of Harry Potter to make a wife and husband fight? <laughs> you are cute, my friend. <laughs> you are so cute. I feel sorry for him. He sounds like a nice guy, by the way. I have nothing against you, but... You are very confused. You don't know how evil this cult, this garbage, this is garbage. This is fiction, stupid story. What Harut and Marut and school? Why he chose the Babylon Tower? Because simply, this is the, you know, there's old, old uh, legions that there is, you know, somebody, he made a tower to go to God. And this is where the angels come down. Why Muhammad, he chose the Babylon Tower? Did you ask yourself? Shall we join the school? What is the school now? Did he close? Is, was it one season? What is this? Who of you would like to divorce his wife? Give me one. I will make a magic for you. Give me your name, please, if you like to divorce your wife. Even if you are single, I will divorce you from your wife. Don't worry. We have a Harut and Marut. I have connection. I am an Arab. I can talk to them. Even the names proven to us that this is a story coming not from the Arab. Harut and Marut. What does that mean? Persian story. This is from the Persian. Harut and Marut. Marino, I'm going to divorce you from your wife. Shahu, Chahu, Marino, Dahu. Chahu, 
Yeah, they remix like you know broadly with some like shahu mahu and harut marut barut chakut kan kshankabut kharkahu tatu tu 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 fruity. Here we go. You will go now home. You will have a fight with your wife. Just wait. All right. I learned this from uh, 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 Prophet Muhammad, peace upon him, who opened harut and barut uh, marut uh, stool. Mental. This is literally mental. Religion of mental illness. Who in, who in the world want to believe in such a garbage? Somebody saying I am an ex-Muslim. Good for you, my friend. But you are missing the point now. If you, I advise you to go back to be a Muslim, don't you? Like, do you know that now your penis will not be endless? What's wrong with you? How you leave this religion? Amazing. And one day you will meet with Harut and Marut and take selfie with them. And maybe they give you a license to open a school to teach how to divorce wife and husband. Look how noble. Look how nice this God. Christian Prince. I don't call me. Just wait, Zach. How you know it's me? First of all, you are the only one who told me at the time. Look, what the heck? What's that? You are the one who called me at the time. Ah, I call you at this time. Okay, Zakir, why Allah is sent Harut and Marut to teach men and women to fight and have divorce? Why he do that? Listen, friends. First of all, you said in your enemy that you have a degree in law. Yeah, I have a degree in law. Okay. Wonderful. If women and wife and husband they are not divorcing, how do you make money? Uh, what? If men and women they are not divorcing, how do you make money? Oh, uh, okay. So Allah is thinking about you. Allah is all merciful. So he said to himself, a person who study have a degree in law and he is going to be a lawyer. How are we going to make money? We have to make a wife and worth death of divorce. And is it proven to you that Allah is all merciful and even though you are a kafir, Allah he like you? Zakir, that's I never thought about it this way. So if Allah is opening the school of divorce, so a lawyer, I mean Supposedly, like me, he can make money exactly. I'm Christian Prince, I got you with it, and I have recorded, and I'm going to publish it. Hey, Zachary Knight, please don't publish this man between you and you. That's in private. Christian Prince, I got you with it, and you know it. Bye bye. What the heck? You cannot win with Zachary Knight, you cannot. He got me busted. Allah, he opened a school of Harry Potter. To divorce a man and wife so lawyers can make money. Hello. What's wrong with you? <laughs> anyway, guys, time to go. I hope you did enjoy your time here. We pray that the Lord will open the eyes of the Muslims and will make them see. I don't want to say see through because they will remember the hate about seeing through with the you know with the women naked women who they have, uh, uh, you know, uh, their marrow of the bones. We pray that they will see the truth and the truth will set them free. This is your brother Christian Prince humbly was serving you for today. I hope you people enjoy it, learn it and share it with your friends. Feel free to download my videos. They are for free for you. And thank you for being here and supporting us. God bless. Christ is Lord. Islam is a fraud. And we prove it every day. I mean, again, he, he doesn't know who Gabriel is, right? Because he didn't come from an Abrahamic faith. The people of Mecca were pagan. The Quran has mentioned if this book was from other than God, they would have found in it many contradictions. If a book is without contradictions, that has no bearing on whether it comes from God or not. I've had phone books that are inerrant, but I certainly don't think God gave them. <laughs> that we believe without understanding. Take this wig of flag, you saw them! That the standard narrative has holes. The prophet That's tells us because Satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils. Those who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan 
urinates in their ears. I really do think Jesus was crucified, <laughs> and that he really was dead and buried. He, he thought that he was a son of God in the sense that he was specially chosen by God. I think Jesus really did think he was going to be the Messiah, the future king of Israel. I mean, that is, after all, why they crucified him. <laughs>